No freaking out. And Vic's Sometimes in her room. Sometimes you just want to break. Yeah. Break. Hello. Oh, look at you. Get laundry. Your laundry done. Ah. Uh, should probably throw our sheets in later too. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. He's got to change. Yeah. In this game. Mm -hmm. Agreed. Got to get the HOH. I just want to win something. Uh, no time. Uh, come on. Uh, you want to well. skip the dishes? <laughs> He's like, no, that's not what I'm talking about. I'm like, but I didn't even have What's a choice a in that. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing I've won is a staring contest. <laughs> the only thing I've won. Yeah, so I, I want rock, paper, scissors. Okay. I'm okay with that. No, I want more. That's what I'm saying. If it's running, I'm going to have to turn into a sprint star. I'm so Catch bad me. at running. I'm not a runner. I think it's going to be a long, long endurance type thing. Let's go. Well, I'll have to I'll suck the hind tit on that one. Catch me running laps all day. God. Growth's a good runner. Hmm? Growth's a good runner. Hmm? Good pace. I feel like Tara has good endurance too. She's a spin instructor, right? She must. Yeah. I would think. Yeah, we need we need someone to win on our side. We gotta flip this around. Mm hmm Do you see how nice it'd be to just have like a chill week? I have to stress. You know what? It's never a chill week in this house. Ever. That's true. Do you honestly think there's going to be a chill week coming? Well, I mean, if I win, I'll make sure it's a chill yeah, week. If any of us win, we're chilling. Oh, thank God. We're chilling. Like, just Me and Mike, everyone can just go sit in the room. On. I'll vibe. I'll turn up the iPod. I'll so what, what's on your iPod? Ah, uh, There's like a good mix. Yeah? Good mix. I, I more... feel that there would be a good mix on your iPod. Yeah. You know, it's here and there. There's not a lot of country, I'll be honest. No, I think I may have two. I think online. I have one country song. Ooh, 100. Yeah. Good old uh, Dolly Parton. Ooh. Oh, cause of yeah. Coat <laughs> of many colors. What's on your list? Oh, I have a mix. Mm. Big mix. Good. You do have a big mix. Yes, yes, yes. Some R&B, some pop, some reggaeton, some EDM. <laughs> Uh, yeah. I also feel like there's like nothing to do when the backyard's closed. Funny about that, hey? I mean, we got this hockey game down there. Nobody touches. I, I just, uh, I guess you're right. I'm just so bad at it. Same. I think that's what my issue is. Only way to get good is to play it. That's true. That is true. You never know. Maybe it's in there because at some point in time, maybe there's going to be a challenge. Stop. To, to, we have to, to play it? Yeah. Oh, God. Well, it's going to be like competition, I'm right? Not winning that one. Winner takes all. Oh, God. Never be know. Awful. Awful shit sure. practice. Also, did someone push their forehead to the glass? Is that why there's that oil stain? No. <laughs> you know what? That's been there for a while now. That is somebody's head leaning up against it. Yeah, 100%. I don't know how anyone can lean against glass, to be quite honest with you. It's kind of scary. Yeah, can't do it. I can't even go to the edge and look out over. Huh. Oh, really? Yeah, not going to so happen. Are you scared of heights? Not going to happen. Hate it. Oh. Mm. Not a fan of heights. Interesting. I get dizzy. Really? Mm. Get a little spinny. Huh. Well, no, let's go matter. see what's going on down in the room. Is that mine? No. Oh, God, did I lose Can my we go to the hot room? Mm -hmm. I don't want to do my water bottle though. Didn't Beth take it? I did, but I went and got it. Now I just don't know what to do with mine. Uh, Might be in the kitchen. Could be, could be. Sitting on the island. Wonder is that it on the table down there? Might be. Might be. All right. You do your thing. We'll chat later. Chat Sounds later. Good. And if anything comes up or anything like that and you hear anything, come talk to me. Absolutely. Okay? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Not so sweet. Mm -hmm. How are you feeling? I think I'm, I'm nervous. Mm -hmm. Obviously. Of course. 
I'd be nervous, Kat. I don't see it. Beth flipping. I really don't. Just because I think she knows that she needs us. Yeah, 100%. I don't see Vic flipping. I don't see Vic flipping either. I don't see Tina or Tara flipping. I don't see Tina or Tara flipping. I don't see you, and that's it. That's all I need. Me, Vic. And I don't see Beth flipping because I think Beth, again, the Beth cutting us both off. Yeah, I, yeah. Really, like that doesn't make any sense. Yeah. I agree. I think I should be okay. I think so too. And if not, man, waterworks. Oh, same. Like, I'll actually bawl my eyes out. <laughs> like, I'll literally just sit on the couch and cry. <laughs> and he'll be like, let's go talk. I'm like, don't touch me. Like, I don't want to talk to any of y'all. Like, every single one of you, don't talk to me. Hello. Hello. Actively. Weird. Yeah. Brutal. Oh, what I was saying. Also, you know, we think it's 5'7". Five, 5'7"? Seven. Five, seven. Mm -hmm. And also there's five windows that are orange. Oh. Interesting. I don't know what's going on. What it means, what it really means. No it means idea. anything, it doesn't. Hello. Hello. This is going to go to the iPod, apparently. Just goes to chilling. Jack? Okay. Jack? Jack? Yeah, maybe after when you guys are like that. Can I talk to you guys real quick? And then I'll just like ask Beth later. Yeah. Like Beth, just like if you do hear anything. Are you just fucking coming back, please? Mm -hmm. Because I can't be like shocked. No. And I'm like, you know, like I get that it's individual games. So obviously, like if she has to go, she has to go. But like, at least just let me know. You know? Imagine she's like, okay, wow. I would actually have hives. Oh, same. I would probably vomit on her. Literally. I'm like, Ugh. Let's go ask if he wants to chat. I'll be here, and then let me know when you want to get iced coffee. Okay. Oh, hello. Would you like to chat in a bit? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, my goodness. to bounce. I feel like Defender might be... Ooh. You want me to, uh, okay. Okay, cool? okay. What's going on? What's going on? I'm going to grab that one. Cool, cool. Where are you bouncing? Where are you sitting? Oh, okay. okay. I'll come sit near you. Into my, my office. Oh, this is your office? Yeah. Okay, good to know, good to know. We're all manifesting, remember? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Your knees, my God. Yeah, so fucking awful. Awful. What's on your mind? I mean, obviously, everyone's been telling me I'm good, but I just need to do my own chatting and making yeah. sure and. Yeah, no. for sure. I'm just trying to gauge where maybe you stand, and I'll let you know yeah. kind of my thoughts. Okay. <laughs> I mean, obviously, like, I've spoken to you and Ty and Beth and Brayden, and, like, I feel good with all of you. Mm -hmm. So, I mm -hmm. mean, having me here is, like, a number 
going forward, which is what mm -hmm. this game boils down to. Right. And I, you know, I try to do well in things. Yeah, I know. <laughs> so, Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, I want to be here really, really badly, and that's, I think, why I'm still stressed, even though I've been told that I'm good from every angle. Mm -hmm. So, I Yeah, mean, I, mean, I mean, I think there's always going to be the, the talk of both sides. Yeah, yeah. There, obviously, and there, and there has been from, Absolutely. from people. Absolutely, absolutely. Um, I think, I don't know if you've talked to everybody yet, but um, I think people still want to see, like, the campaigning and stuff like that. Yeah. Because, like, yeah, yeah. if there hasn't been any, then... People, that's kind of what happened to Latoya. Like yeah. she didn't talk to anybody and yeah. just assumed that she was staying. Yeah. And then she ended up getting snipped. So I talked uh, to a few people, but yeah. people like leave rooms when I go in now. I'm know. like, huh? I know. Yeah, I don't know. Um, yeah, I guess for me, it's just like again, like reassuring that like we do have that like loyalty and trust, you know, moving forward. Yeah. Because obviously things are being said about people mm -hmm. and like people being together and people coming for me and people coming for us, you know what I mean? Oh, yeah. So, I mean, I guess just moving forward, my only concern would be, like, if you won, if I'm on the block. <laughs> <laughs> and, oh, and, and my it's, God. It's always going to be concerned because I just keep hearing it. But the thing is, <laughs> I keep hearing it, too. Yeah. You know, like, I heard all week this week that it was you and Ty pitching right. me to Kiefer, right. and you guys were in the HOH room arguably the most out of anyone right. and I'm on the block right. but I decided I'm like hey if I want to work with these people I can't sit there and go oh they're pitching me they're coming after me mm -hmm. like I can't put that in my head or else it will never work like that's right. what I was telling Ty yesterday like I've I've heard these things I've heard it swirling but I'm just not going to like I can't entertain it if we want to go forward yeah exactly or else we're always going to be in this position where we're scared of each other right you know what I mean? Yeah, like, I, I don't want to play the game that way where I'm paranoid. Like, yeah. that's why I'm so close with Brandon, because I just know. Like, I'm like, I know that whatever happens, we have each other. Mm -hmm. And that's how I want to be going forward. Right. So, right. Okay. I don't know. Yeah, I mean. That's kind of where I stand. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, I mean, obviously, we didn't, like, we were not pitching you to go up. Mm -hmm. um, like, he had that plan from the very beginning mm -hmm. from his HOH mm -hmm. I think like that's what he says he says that he wanted to get one of Kyle a row out mm -hmm. and the only way that Kyle would go is if you were up there mm -hmm. so I mean we're just going to do what he wants at this point mm -hmm. um, but it wasn't like our decision yeah so I just hope you know that at least um, I do agree with the move in the sense of like if Kyle we want Kyle to go then it's the best thing that you're there because mm -hmm. anyone else would probably get flipped on. Yeah. Um, same thing that happened to, like, Latoya, right? Yeah. So, um, and then just, like, the... Like, yeah, it's just, like, the thought process of, like, who would not... Who would stay over him, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, if they put someone else up, like, Dick or something like that, like, she would be going home, you know? Mm -hmm. So that's... I think that was the thought process behind that. Like, it wasn't, like, our decision at all. Like, whatever. Um... But yeah, other than that, it's just like, I mean, it's pretty clear that there's, there's size to this game. Mm -hmm. And um, I think like the only concern was like with what we were hearing last week about the backdoor thing. Um, so obviously Ty was like kind of sketched out about that. Absolutely. I'm pretty sure he talked to you about that. I time. talked to him, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So that was like the only thing. Um, but I mean, if you say that you weren't involved in that, then... I, I didn't even know that it was a thing until Beth came to the bathroom. Like, yeah. and she told us what was going down. I'm like, what the hell is going on? Yeah. Just because, like, I played in the veto. Gun first, tried to keep knobs the same for Vic. Didn't win. Right. You know, like, it wasn't even on my radar of, like, oh, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, why would it have been? Right. I wasn't even HOH. I didn't have power. Like, I'm not going to go and be like, yo, yeah. it would be so funny. Like, yeah. Oh, it's like, it doesn't make sense Yeah. for me to do that. Yeah. The same way that, like, when I was hearing stuff from everyone else that you guys were coming for me, mm. that I end up on the block, I wasn't going to spiral with right, that. Right. Like, I, I can't. Right. Like, literally, when I was up there playing for the HOH, Keith really looked at me, he's like, they're coming for you. Yeah. And I was like, huh? <laughs> like, I was, like, shook. I was like, what? <laughs> What? Is that what he said? Yeah. Literally so, like, scary. Like, you'll watch back. <laughs> you're going to watch back, and you're going to be like, huh? Like, whispered? Like, he looked at me, because like, I told him, like, no matter what happens, like, you're good with me. He's like, same, same, same. I'm like, okay, great. And then he looked at me, he's like, they're coming for you. And I was like, 
Pardon? It's so theatric. It's got it was, I literally was up there and I was like, huh? Jeez. That is wild. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow, that's crazy. Mm-hmm. Um, so, other than that, like, are you able to, to tell me that you aren't in an alliance with Roe? I'm not in a line with throw. I literally have been through this a billion times. Literally, sure? it's driving me nuts. It's driving me nuts. Because we were playing in the ball pit. Yeah. Literally the four of us. Yeah. yeah. But and it's deeper than that stuff. Like, it's deeper no, than I know. just being around each other. No, I know. But then Josh said it in front of everyone, and then we were all in slop together. So everyone's like, you're in an alliance. Like, right. I've grown close to Kyle and Roe just because of, like, I guess, circumstances. Yeah. Like, we've literally just been kind of push together through we were on slop together now yeah. we're on the block together like I don't know and my whole situation with my HOH like we did get closer from it because they immediately just like had my back from that right we've never like put together an alliance we've never like been like hey let's all do this together but we are close like yeah. personally we're close yes. game wise Great like guys. yeah like Great I just guys. I genuinely enjoy them as people yeah like, even, like, with me and Kyle, like, we're not hanging out and, like, spinning game and, like, whatever. We're literally just, like, hanging out to I don't know. Out. He literally says that he has just, like, like to talk, like, to him by Yeah. And, like, Ro is really tight with Kyle. I'm really tight with Brayden. So, like, we end up hanging out. Right. I don't have some, like, formal game agreement with them where I'm, like, oh, let's, like, do this and mm-hmm. da-da-da. Because I came to you guys before any of that. Like, right. I was with you guys before that. And then I tried to reestablish it even after shit almost hit the fan on my HOH. Yeah. Like... The person that I'm loyal to in this game, 100%, is Brayden. Mm -hmm. He is my ride-or-die person here. Right. You know what I mean? Yeah. I think everyone has someone like that. Exactly. And that's not something that you should be penalized for. Yeah. It's like everyone has one of those. So in terms of everyone else that I've been linked to, it's not like that. Like, it isn't like that at all. Right. At all. Yeah, because I think, like, the only thing that, from what I've heard from around the house, is, like, the only worry people have is that like yes Kyle is a dangerous player but at least he like has shown his cards like he know like I know that if Kyle was here he would be coming for me like mm-hmm. I just know that mm-hmm. so like at least I can kind of like prepare for it and and kind of make moves based on that whereas we don't like like people don't know exactly where your head's at in the sense of like would you put Roe on the block I don't think so you know what I mean like stuff like that like, would you put certain people in the block? I don't know. But, like, for me, vice versa, mm-hmm. this entire week I'm told that if you guys win, I'm going up. This week? Yes. I've been told multiple times that if yeah. you or Ty or Beth win, which shocks me, yeah. that me and Brayden would be up. That's yeah. literally what we've been hearing all week long. Well, it's just been, like, vice versa. That's what I mean. <laughs> That's what I mean. Yeah, so, yeah, like... Yeah. With all this talk, you kind of have to, like, have a little bit of faith in the fact yeah. that what I'm telling you makes sense, and I think it does. I think it makes sense, for sure. I just don't know. I mean, I told Ty the same thing. I said, like, we're either at a point where you trust me or you don't. Yeah. Like, I've, cho- I've made the decision to trust you guys, like, yeah. even after everything I've heard and me ending up on the block and mm-hmm. you guys clearly being the ones that were here most of the time with Kiefer, mm-hmm. I just decided myself, like, I can't get paranoid that the boys are coming after me at this point. Right. Like, I just can't. Right. Right. So, I mean, like... Well, yeah, and I, and I just think, like, it all boils down to, like, yes, like, week two happened, and everything happened, but, like, at the same time, it's, like, like, we need to move on. You know what I mean? I agree. Because, like, that was... We can't, like, I, I, like, I think you'd be upset if we ended up literally coming after you because of Josh. You know? Because that's what it boils down to. I agree. It really was just because of Josh. So, I like, 100% agree. Like, is it worth it? You know what I, I mean? I think... The issue was Josh planted a lot of seeds, mm-hmm. and then anything that anyone did, they seemed to grow. Right. Just because it was the thought was there. Right. You know, like so many alliances have been thrown around, so many people working together have been thrown around. Mm-hmm. But the reality is, if I was working with Roe and all of these people, I wouldn't be like, oh, hey guys, like let's also do this, because I would just end up getting stuck. Like I would right. literally just be stuck somewhere and be like, wow, okay, now what do I do? Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, I mean it's possible. Like, I mean, people try to play both sides, but um, I don't know. I don't. I didn't. I don't think that's the situation you want to be in <laughs> at all. Yeah, because I want people that I can feel like I have loyalty with, no matter what. Right. And I know that you guys all have that with each other. I have that with Brayden. So we clearly all have that trait going mm-hmm. for us. Mm-hmm. So that's kind of like where my head is at. So if you were in, or Brayden won the HOH, who would you put up? <sighs> 
I, I'm not 100% on who that those people would be. It wouldn't be you guys. Mm -hmm. That's like what I can say for sure. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I don't know. Okay. I would have to talk to everyone and see what's going on because I've been told so much shit this week. Right. So much shit. But I think that's when people get worried because it's like, if you ask that to like Ro and Kyle, like they would say us, which is fine. But at least they say us. You know what I mean? Whereas like, I don't know, I don't want to get in a situation where like you're telling me that now, but then you, all of a sudden you, you get HOH, then you put So who would you put up? Me? Yeah. Who would I put up? Mm hmm I mean, I'd probably put up Ro. Mm hmm And, and a pawn or something. At that point. Would the pawn be me or Brayden? Maybe Vic. Maybe Vic? Yeah. Okay. I think so. But I can sit here and confidently tell you names, but like, I, you know what I mean? I mean, you just said like, maybe this, maybe that. Like, I, I don't know that I call. Oh, I would 100% put up Ro. <laughs> like, like we're, we're, we're clearly done for it. Like, it's clear now. Like, yeah. he has said it to us, we've said it to him. So, yeah. I mean, it's just easy. It's easy. But at least I can say yeah. that. Whereas, yeah. like, if you don't know, if you still don't know. I would, it's not that I still don't know. I just don't know who would benefit me the most at this point because I've heard like that Tara's coming after me randomly mm. like I've just heard a lot of shit right. come out about that right. I mean I don't know that I've heard that Ro is specifically coming after me mm -hmm. just because we've like we're friends right I don't think he would yeah so I don't know if maybe I would just try to like split up that duo right. just to break up the numbers a little bit I don't right. know if maybe I feel good with Vic I don't think I would put Pick up, so I guess we'd boil down to Tina and Tara, then see kind of where. Yeah, I think like Tara is also an option, like yeah, for me as well. So yeah, I just feel like I mean, there's there's, there's definitely options, but it just like that's what I mean. The thing is, with me is like, like we're we're in week four, right? Like, mm -hmm. I don't think this is the time to be like breaking like like loyalty and stuff. You know what I mean? Like, like I agree. I know we haven't done much to like establish it yet. Because I agree. Because it hasn't really been an opportunity. Yeah. Um, but I just feel like... I mean, on the spot, I don't have a 100% answer for you. Oh, as I don't think either. I don't, I don't either. I don't that's, either. That's why, I, that's why. Like, yeah, like, things change once people come in here and they say things. Absolutely. And they change your Absolutely. Mind. But I think, like, just, yeah, like, as of right now, like, you clearly, like, there are, there's definitely, like, there's probably, like, you, everyone probably has about three or four mm -hmm. options. Mm -hmm. That would they, like, they're just, they're just not tight, tight with it. That's why I said, like... The first thing that came out was it wouldn't be you guys. Yeah, yeah. That's what I like. If yeah. that's what your worry is, that's not something that I would be worried about if I were you. If I were to win, right. That's all I. Yeah. Like that's my most definitive answer to you. Right. Okay. Other than that, I would need to see what the hell's going on because I've just heard so much shit. Yeah, I know. Just it's so actually, much just, shit. Yeah, it's crazy. And you know there's what like I mean? blatant lies flying around, like blatant lies. Yeah. Okay. Blatant. Like, I've just heard the most heinous stuff, and I'm like, really? How did this even happen? I was just chilling. Yeah, I know. Like. I know. You know what I mean? But, yeah, and I think a lot of people are just like, I think I think a lot of people are just like upset with how the last couple of evictions have gone. Absolutely. And also like how the people on the block have acted in the sense of like, it's always just like pre-assumed who's going home. Yeah, no, like, I know. No one actually campaigns. I know. So it's just like, okay, I guess I'll just like, you know, writing's on the wall, I'm just going to go, mm -hmm. like, you know? Mm -hmm. So that's why I was telling you yesterday, just like, Make sure you're talking to people because. And I am. Yeah, just because like, you get too comfortable. <laughs> no, you never I know. know. People are like, maybe she, is, maybe she is good to get like the best to go. Yeah, home. no, I know. Because like there have been people saying like you be better to go. So Who? you need to make sure that you talk to people. Who? <laughs> I can't tell you, but like you I, can't tell me. I don't think like it's 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 not it's not like just one or two. So it's like like we like we will show you that we have we are loyal to you. Like we will show you that. This okay. Week. Okay. But I want you to keep that same energy. If you absolutely. Win. Jed, absolutely. I'm like, not you know, we are the, like, we have the numbers, right? Absolutely. So. But just, the thing is, too, like, you know, when you show me that, like, going forward, we, we need them. We can't just, mm -hmm. you know. Because, mm -hmm. like, if, I don't know, if that were to happen, I was blindsided, like, that would immediately, like, subtract Brandon out of the equation. Like, he would just, you know what I mean? Oh, like, oh. Numbers like wise. Numbers wise, oh, he'd be like, "This isn't." <laughs> oh, everyone knows that if like if you mess with you, like you mess with him too. Like it's just, it's like a package deal. 100%. Yeah, yeah. And there's a lot of people like that in this game. Like, you mess Absolutely. With Tina, you mess with Tara. Like, same shit. <laughs> yeah. Like, like you mess with Kyle, you mess with Ro. It's the same thing. Yeah, I think um, my bottom line is I feel good with you guys, and I mean, I think I'll see it Thursday. I hope I see it Thursday. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, unless something crazy happens, which I don't see happening. Unless Kyle does something crazy, I don't know what's going like. Yeah. Like that. 
I do think you should be pretty like comfortable. Mm-hmm. You should be. Mm-hmm. Um, I just wouldn't appear to be. If I no. Were, you know what I mean? And I'm honestly not. Like, yeah. I, I feel good, mm-hmm. but I, I'm obviously still nervous, especially that I've just heard so much shit swirling around that I'm like, I don't even know where this is coming from. Yeah. It's convenient that it's coming out when I'm just sitting on the block. Like, oh, yeah. I mean, that's what happens, right? Absolutely. People want you out, maybe, for their game, mm-hmm. but it's not... But, but, like, in order to do that, they would have to create some narrative, you know what I mean? Absolutely. So it's like, I know that you're not... You have being out is not good for my game. No, you know, and yeah. it's not in my best interest. Yeah. So I won't entertain those chats. But other people that maybe think it is in their best interest, they have been entertaining those chats. Yeah. But at the end of the day, like you need the numbers to do it. Absolutely. So, Absolutely. But as long as you know that, um, like you just you just need to talk to everybody yeah. and make sure that they know that you're not just sitting pretty, and oh yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah. Um, but like, have you? Like, I'm pretty confused. Like, what's Kyle doing? <laughs> like, I don't know. Like, have you talked? Like, I, I, I've spoken to him. And is I he just, just like chilling? Like, he hasn't talked to me once. Yeah, I think he might. Like, he came to me today and he said, like, hey, like, I think I might start talking to people, but I'm not going to throw you under the bus for anything. Right, like, that's right. not what I want to do. Right. Just because we are friends. Right. So, I think it would just suck for both of us if also we, like, left and we were, like, pissed at each other. Absolutely. Um, that would be really, yeah, that's not a good situation. No. And that's kind of what I, like, I'm not saying anything against Kyle. No, like, I'm just down. speaking for myself. Exactly. Um, I think, you know, Keith made it pretty clear when he put me up there that I was the pawn and he was the target. So I think that's also in his head. Mm-hmm. And he kind of had his little moment right after I was nominated where he kind of laid it out. Yeah. And he was, it was like, your house is grass. And he was like, I know. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I no. mean? So I think he's kind of going out with that knowing as well i think he'll still have conversations today yeah i can't say what he'll say i have no idea i have no clue i can't even gauge it i mean i assume it'd be along the lines of like just because he he's very definitive Mm -hmm. so he can tell people like i am going for jay yeah you know what i mean yeah i am yeah like so that's but then again like I think people are more worried about what he, cause like what he would do to them. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Because last week was pretty bad in the sense of like mm-hmm. with the HOH, and then all of a sudden this week like Vic is getting thrown under the bus pretty hard. Mm-hmm. So people are scared that that would happen to them. Yeah. So that's why I think most people are rubbed the wrong way right now yeah. towards him. I think that's what Kiefer told me too. He was like, when I don't want that to happen yeah, to me. Yeah, just terrified of that. Yeah. Like all of a sudden, you know, he gets you out, and then next week he can't play. And then they just throw them out. They throw them out of the like out of the bus, you know. Yeah. That'll be the worst. That's the worst case scenario for an H O H. The week after H O H is the most vulnerable you'll ever be. Yeah. So. Oh yeah. You know, you probably yeah, felt yeah. it. Absolutely. But um. But no, I think we're good, for sure. Yeah. Um. I'm, I don't know if talk, Kyle's gonna talk to me today, but I haven't talked to him yet. Yeah. So like, at least you coming and talking to me multiple times is like good. Yeah. And I do feel, um, I feel good with you. I mean. I mean, you haven't given me any reason not to. <laughs> I mean, I've been H H before, and yeah, you weren't on the block, exactly, so. Exactly. I mean. Yeah. Yeah, I know for sure. Um, yeah. I would just maybe ask too, like, if anything did change, just let me know. Oh, absolutely. Or else I'll just be like a crying mess. I know. Brayden will be tearing the house down. I'll like be that. sobbing. I want to see Brayden like that. Yeah. Jesus. I'll have to go out to a restaurant. She'll be like, can you relax? I'm like, I can't, girl. Yeah. Like. Well, the one thing I will tell you is that, like, I am, like, whatever I'm doing tomorrow will be made sure tonight and I'm not doing anything tomorrow like I'm not okay I'm sitting so I'm finding tomorrow. you tonight to see what you're yeah to see what your vote I'm not saying like I'm flip flopping anytime soon but I'm just saying like I, I've said from now on Wednesday night you're decided <laughs> I'm done and Thursday I'm just chilling yeah. on the couch yeah so yeah it won't be like a 20 minute before hey, I'm scramble I think you're going I think you're going yeah no it won't be like that I don't think any of us can handle it no, anymore I'm done with that it's too much I'm done with that like, it's the ridiculous. heart attacks on the house it on the couch ridiculous. it's too much our is probably like what is going on our season is fucked <laughs> fucked week two some crazy flip for no reason like what no I know <laughs> for the sake of Josh, Josh. No, I was thinking about that I'm like this is all for Josh this is all Josh Josh's fault <laughs> literally it's all Josh's fault He's probably pumped about it, though. Oh, he's probably so pumped. So pumped. He's like, when, oh, when, the blood, <laughs> when there's a bloodbath. I'm like, yeah, true. True, 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 true. <laughs> yeah. But okay. 
That sounds good to me. Sounds good to me as well. The only, the only other promise I need is that, like, Friday, like, you can cook dinner. I mean, I have <laughs> said... <laughs> I have said that if I'm here, yeah. I will whip something up. Okay. So. I can't be like vegetarian or anything like that either. Oh, it needs to be meat. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Deal. I'm kidding. I have the, I have the veg option, you know, for Bray, right? But. Of course, of course. But I think it's about it's about time you guys, you know. It's about time. Hit the chef. Well, okay. So here's the reason. Last time Brayden cooked with someone, she went home. Oh, Julie. Yeah. You're right. So we were gonna thing. cook. Then we're like, we can't cook until Friday. Oh. We cannot cook. That's true. That's, that That's also why Brayden didn't go in the hot tub yesterday. Why? Last time in the hot tub? Because I was going to go in being like, oh, just in case. Like, I get picked. Right. <laughs> and then I'm like, you should come in too, like, just in case. And he's like, but then I feel like I'm cementing it. So, <laughs> so you're cementing it? Yeah. If he, like, gets in for, like, the one last hurrah. Oh, like the last hurrah in the hot tub. Yeah. Jeez. Man, you guys are superstitious. Eh? Listen, I'm serious about being here. Absolutely. So I'm not going to chance it by bopping Imagine the hot Imagine that. Tub. You probably never let yourself forget like forget that. No. I should have won that fucking hot tub. I should have cooked them dinner. I should have had stir fry on a Wednesday night. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. That's funny. Yeah. That yeah, yeah, funny. yeah. All right. Well, I'll keep you updated. Thank you. But, um, yeah, I mean... I mean, I think you're good. Thanks. I think. I'm also fun and cool and nice, so there's really? that. I think so. Really? Yeah. Okay. That's a good asset. Yeah. To have in the house. I think so. Did you say Kyle isn't fun, cool, and nice? He is. <laughs> in different ways. In I very... I guess you have a prettier face than him, though. So. Beauty's in the eye of the beholder. Right. Right. I guess some people think Kylie's pretty cute, too. Some people. <laughs> Kylie? Allegedly. <laughs> Allegedly, Kylie's been out here. <laughs> Kylie. 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 All right, so we'll set a next appointment for uh, 9.30 p.m. 9.30 p.m. Yep. Let me know. 9.30. And I'll let you know the, uh, the, yeah. the final scoop. Yep. The final scoop. Final scoop. -a -doo -a -doo -a -doo. Yes, yes. And mm. let's hope that it's not an anxiety-inducing <laughs> sitting there. I think I'm going to be anxious anyway. I think no matter what. Like, even I'm like on the blog, I'm anxious, like, all the time. All the time. All the time. Like, even on the couch, just sitting there, I'm just anxious. Yeah. Do you know what you're going to say? Yeah? No. Oh, shit. You better start working. House guests. Oh, my God. <laughs> I hate it. Oh, my God. What are you going to say? I don't know. <laughs> do I do a shout out to the fam? Oh, I don't know. Like, what Toya did. Yeah, she did a little to Pluto. Pluto. Isn't that her dog? I thought yeah, so. Yeah, I think it is. Pluto's going crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Side. So, wait, what do you, what do you, yeah, what do you say? Are you gonna like do an actual campaign, or are you just gonna like shout out and be like, "Thank you all, it was nice." It was I think nice I'll, to get I to think I'll you. say like a, you know, like an actual campaign, like a like a thank you for whatever, yeah, yeah, yeah. and then say like a little something, sit my ass down. Okay. I honestly like I am so mushy for all of you guys. Like yesterday when I was looking at the moon and like realized I was on the block and like I could be leaving, yeah. I started crying because I'm oh, like I love all these people. Oh my gosh, I know it's actually very sad. Yeah. Well, it's kind of, and it's especially when it gets further down the line, it'll get to a point where it's just like, even if you like hate somebody on the game level, like it's still gonna be sad as you think. Oh, oh my god! Even with them for like 40, 50 days. Like, like we've been together for almost a month. I know. Almost all day, long. like all day. Twenty four hours. And I'm not sick of you guys yet. Like, I don't know. what is going on? I don't know. It's pretty fun, I think. Honestly, it is. At the end fun. of the day, it is like a fun situation. It's so fun. Yeah, I, I, I try not to take it like too seriously. Just relaxing. It's warm out there, isn't it? Mm -hmm. We're piled. Warm and expedient for sure. Yeah, this is the best place to, yeah. um, to cool down. Cool down a bit. Yeah. Funny guy, honestly, probably the funniest guy I've ever met. Honestly, <laughs> same. I'm pissed. I was You're trying pissed? to like stay away from him just you well, know. I, I think awesome everyone's trying to not be like in a duel. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, really hard. I couldn't help. I might actually like, have a chance to beat you then. So we literally. Ooh. Me? <laughs> I don't know, man. <laughs> really tough. He's got some he's got some good moves. We clear. Yeah. Literally. <laughs> I suck. Uh, really, I'm stupid. Was yeah, that? it was just if you had me if you didn't lose your queen. I was having heat stroke. <laughs> I was having heat stroke. <laughs> <laughs> he wasn't thinking right. You ever play chess? 
Uh, I tried yesterday. How'd that go? Disaster. <laughs> Disaster. But I learned from Kyle, who also doesn't know Who how won play. between you and Jake? Oh. So he wasn't oh. sure. It gets more fun every time, though. Mm. Yeah. That's what I'll say. It's hard when the person yeah. thinks he doesn't know It much. gets more yeah. intense every time. We yeah. both didn't know what we were doing. So we're like, mm. <laughs> You should have seen how heated Tara was, was when good. we told her that rule. Yeah. Oh, I, I didn't even know it. Yeah, I know, I know. And I just kept ending Wasn't the old time. Like, why are we uh, both here? <laughs> Look, we are yep. the whole to separate. Yeah, now changed. she wants clean slate. That the changes the whole game. Literally. Literally. Oh, yeah. It does change the whole game. It does, yeah. Because it, it really means none of those wins counted. No. Yeah, so it's clean slate now. Now we got to start over. Because anything could have happened. Tara and I are about, Tara would have learned if, because we were playing, yeah. it was about to be checkmate. But we stopped. I got called to the DR. Ah. Uh, so she would have she would have got that last night. Classic. DR saved a lot of people. Yeah, for real. <laughs> Kyle, what is your occupation? Good night, house guests. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they got him there. They saved him there. Oh, I can't saved. wait to find out. I know. Huh? I just want to watch this guy's bio. Here, it sounds wild. Yeah, I know. He's like chugging beers and stuff. Oh, my God. He's ice skating in his underwear. Underwear, yeah. Mechanical engineer. That's Petro either. Petroleum engineer. <laughs> Out there in... Alberta. Alberta. In the bird. A lot of them out there. Oh yeah. yeah. In the fields. Oh the true. Sounds. All my buddy all my buddies used to go there. Uh, after high school they go there for like a couple years. Sounded like a grind. Yeah, it's oh a grind. Goodness. Work one month, get one month off. Yep. We have a lot of people from Newfoundland fly up. It's Alberta? Back and forth. It's Alberta. I, know, I met a lot of Newfoundlanders in Alberta. Oh yeah. Yep. Oh, I mean. Did you get any more ingredients for tonight or no? I didn't look. None unless the pantry's closed. It'll still be good, <laughs> but it won't be great. You know what I mean? I'm down for good. Yeah. We got, <laughs> and we don't have onions either. Like. Oh, yeah, that's a huge part. That's a huge part. A staple. Do we have body wash? <laughs> nope. What's that got to do with chili? We're using shampoo. Yeah, I know, yeah. right? <laughs> Rub that in. <laughs> Freaking skin is drying out like crazy. <laughs> Bless you. Oh my god. Boy, you've been sneezing all night. He has. I was I was sneezing like crazy today too. It's springtime, guys. Come on. You're you're locked in a house. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What does that mean? There's no elements of spring in here. <laughs> it's in the air. Oh my god. We've been in the same air for weeks. Pollen in the air. Oh god. Doing today? I hope not. Doing things stress me out. Every, what? Doing things stresses him out. Oh. Plus there's an odd number of people, so I would probably just be the host if like you know yeah. what I mean? You probably what? Would he's be like, like the host He's again. cool with that. Host yeah. What? I would be cool with that. For what? Imagine they're like Whatever. psych! Eviction. Today? Oh my god. <laughs> I'd vomit. <laughs> House guests to the living room. Yeah. I'd vomit. Oh, man. Any sad. minute now. And <laughs> yeah, whenever I hear Arissa's voice, that's when I'm like, <gasps> oh, my God. I know. Then you, then you know some shit's it's, going yeah. down. <laughs> One day it's going to have, like, the TV just going to turn on. Like, you know how that happens sometimes? Yeah. yeah. And that's when it's going to shit my pants. See Vic sprinting from her room. Yeah. <laughs> Titties all over the place. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, she flew past me last night to get out to the hot tub, man. Really? I've never seen her run so fast. It was hilarious. When she heard the 15 minutes, yeah. she was like, oh, shit, let me get out there. She bolted. And she heard the four times a day and just bolted back inside. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Just shook. We dog going in the bathroom. She's just like, I can't believe it. It's so awkward. <laughs> <clears throat> That's funny. That TV in the living room really is underused, though. Yeah, it is. You're telling me it's just on to say Big Brother Canada exactly. all day? Branding. Mm -hmm. At least play some old old seasons or something. Play something, yeah. <laughs> Imagine. Some cool stuff on that, right? Sometimes, oh, like, they get, cool like, a new episode of whatever's what I mean. going down on yeah. Global. Kyle and I are down if you want to play. Oh, I'm down. Okay, I'm just going to go to the washroom, then I'll be down. All right, come back and grab yeah. it. I bet Rose good at. Is, did you, have you guys? Oh. Did you beat him or what? I was so close to beating him. I made one wrong move and he I beat me. I do kind of need. And he oh, beat you. Coffee in my system. Okay, Oz. Okay. Be, okay. See you later. 
He beat EJ? Thanks yeah, for chatting, friends. No. Oh, no. yeah, oh my beat, god, Susan. Susan. Yeah, <laughs> oh Susan. Can you win with no queen? Yeah, he beat me, but I had him on the ropes. You can, but they have to have no queen as well. Oh. Uh, basically. If what? Can you win without a queen and they have one? I don't know. Can you beat so yeah, like I don't I don't see how that means. Rooks. You need like a rook and a bishop. You need both yeah. rooks. Once you lose that queen, I basically just want to quit. Yo, I got my queen back, he took it right back. It really? was so harsh. Yeah. I got her back, he went, he went and beat me to the baseline. <laughs> beat me to, to the, the baseline. baseline. To the baseline. Got my pawn to the I baseline. I use the baseline as another defender. That's a triggering, All this triggering, a triggering line right there. To the baseline! Remember suicides? We never even did that. We, well, actually, yeah, we did, but we did mostly down and backs. In, in at, at Western? Western was always down and back. Yeah. High school was always suicides. No, we did suicides in other Yo, fuck it. If I'm going to expedient. It was free shoot. throws. Depending on what we were, we have to shoot as a team. So Ours we, was like winning team shot two free throws. If you make them both and you don't run at all, if you miss one, you run one. If you miss both, you run two. We did that too, but we also just had a free throw drill where we'd shoot as a... Oh, as I a did squad, that in high school. ten free throws. Everybody goes shoots ten, oh, and yeah. then depending if we're plus or minus, over eighty percent. Yeah, depends on how. Oh, so that's what minus exactly five. What we did. Yeah. Is it individual though, right? Individual, but then as we come together as a team, yeah. Then we run as a team, depending yeah. on what for plus or minus. So it wouldn't be individual runs, and then or like you only run for the amount that you missed, right? Or the sometimes you do it like that, or sometimes the whole team has to run. Oh. So if the whole team is minus eight. Yeah. We're definitely running a suicide. Oh, I see what you're saying. Or what he would do is he put us all on the baseline and give give us a chance to earn it back. See, so like somebody come shoot two free throws. You got to go shoot. Nothing? Yeah? Like kind of like that, uh, yeah. yeah. And if you go one for two, you'll hit cheese them. One for two is a cheese as well. Where was that, Laurentian? Yeah. McGill was never there. I feel like McGill, we barely. Janky ass rims. Right? <laughs> I feel like McGill, we never did drills. We just hooped. Really? Yeah, I That's swear the best. That's the best. <laughs> Apparently, Carlton was like that too. In practice, they just hoop. Yeah. Yeah, man. Are you actually doing one? Huh? Are you actually doing <laughs> Are one? Are you doing one now? Why? You guys already fucking write me off? No, no you're right. No, I just wasn't sure off. if you were doing one. <laughs> no, no, no. I was made just... it sound like you're just like, I'm... I'm no, it's late. just a... Uh, it was a long week. Yeah, man, for sure. I, I was just it. taking a few days. Um, and then, obviously, it's hard to do against her, but... Yeah. Um, I guess first of all, I, I'll, I'm just gonna leave her out of the pitch. Okay. Um, but I do want to stay. I want to be here, mm -hmm. and I think we've always been on the same page with getting like wishy-washy players out. Mm -hmm. Um, keeping me, me in this game in particular, I put a target on myself with, you know, the blow up with Kiefer. Mm -hmm. Um, twice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, obviously, you guys are big targets just physically looking yeah. at you, right? I ha so I'm a big target who hasn't done well in comps so far. Right. And honestly, if I get to jury, eventually, I'm, I'm assuming you two want to go as far as you can together. I mean, that's obvious. One At some point during the game, somebody's going to have to take a shot at Keefe. Mm -hmm. And if it's me that takes a shot at Keith later on in the game, I'm not, not obviously not next week. Obviously, that'd be a conversation I have with you guys mm -hmm. of who you want to be going up. Mm -hmm. But you're not going to be the one to take a shot at Keith because he's an emotional guy. It's, if it's one of you two in the final two and one of you was the one to evict him, like he's going to hold that. There's not a chance in Sans hell that he votes for me to win in the end because right. he doesn't like me. Right. Like there's, there's zero chance. Right. And I think that's an asset too. So. Do you think he votes for Austin if she wins though? That that I don't know. Yeah. I mean, you guys talk to him a little more than me, but. Yeah. Um, well, I just know that they've been like, you know, she targeted him, and like, I don't think he likes her that much. So. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I mean, what would what would you guys want for me? Because I know obviously you guys have Paul with Keith. Mm -hmm. Um. But I think it is in your best interest to not want me out, just because. Mm -hmm two physical threats I haven't done fucking anything in comps mm -hmm. and somehow I'm the biggest me and Roe are the biggest targets mm -hmm. which is good for you guys yeah and I'm, I'm not coming after you I know Roe's not coming after you so who are you going after if I were to win next week mm -hmm. would you guys want me to win next week 
if you did. If you, if, you, if you came to me and were like, we're keeping you, we fucking want HOH. And it's me and you three at the end? Yeah. Sure. I think our only worry is that, like, like we just heard that, like, basically you and Ro were, like, gunning for us 100%. No, we, and we, we've heard the same thing about you guys from day one, too. Right. There's just so much shit that we haven't uh, believed. Yeah. That we get told, we get told, dude. I've been told, I've been told Austin's coming after me since like day three, <laughs> Jesus. by people, and I just kind of, I don't even bring that up to her because it's just, I just like wash it under the rug because I know right. people are just the broken telephone. Right. But no, we're not coming after you. And I mean, we had that combo before. When was that before? Before the before Toya the went home. Age. Before the Toya. Yeah. Yeah. And I was still on board with that, so like, mm-hmm. wishy washy players. Do you want me to say names? Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna do. Well, if it's, it's <laughs> I, not I us, know, then I who? know you love names. I love Banksy. Names. Banksy loves names. I want to hear names, names, who names. and why. <laughs> 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 Obviously, I did. Me and Ro did Vic a little dirty last week, right? So yeah. that's not someone I'd really want to to be putting up. Um, but I think Tina and Tara would be on my radar. I know Tara has been on yours mm-hmm. before. Mm-hmm. And obviously, I have a good personal connection with them, but yeah. same as with Austin. Like, I don't want to see her go, but I I don't want to go even yeah, more exactly. than even more than that. Exactly. Um. Yeah. So and, and like yeah. I said with the Kiefer thing, like, I'm not gonna. I'm I I am an emotional guy, but I'm also like I'm in Big Brother, so mm-hmm. eventually he's gonna have to be out of this game, and I have a reason to go after him at some point. Right. Um, so I think that takes like washes your guys' hands clean if me or Ro or someone else is the one to take Kiefer out, the most emotional guy in here yeah. who's about like all that stuff. So when right. he's in jury, he's going to be like, you know what? Those are my boys. These are my boys. Right. Like they had my back. They had my back. Kyle fucking Ro. They backstabbed me. They kicked me out of this game. And it's coming to that point where it's almost jury. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Like only one more eviction, right? Yeah. Um, I guess my only other thing was just like, like, I don't know if this was like lies as well, but just like hearing that, like you guys thought that we controlled Kiefer this week, like this was our HOH, like. I, that uh, personally didn't come out of my mouth, right. but those were the murmurs that we, right. were, we were hearing. Where it's like, we really, like we just want you to know that we didn't. Like okay. he yeah. had this plan from the yeah. very beginning. Yeah, like, yeah. He had, he wanted you guys up from the very before you even won HOH. Uh-huh. So like he had a personal emotional reason to do that. Yeah. And then, I mean, other than that, yo. Dang it, people yo, are yo, 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 <laughs> yo. I guess I am hanging with you guys. Uh, and I and I kind of I, I could kind of tell the that we were gonna go up just because I know we didn't tell about Latoya, yeah. mm-hmm. and I could just see it in, in your guys' face like. They, they probably know, but, like, obviously you can't say anything. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, I don't even look at that in the game as, like, because sometimes you just can't. Your hands are tied. Right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I don't, like, hold those kind of grudges. Right. And, like, we don't even hold a grudge about that. Like, obviously no. she was, like, we were close with her and everything, but at the end of the no. day, like, we know the game. We know the move was good. Yeah. Um, and I think Kiefer was extremely close with her, uh-huh. Latoya, and I think because before she left, she had said, like, do this, you know, like if you mm-hmm. win, do mm-hmm. this for me. And like he yeah. really did hold on to that and he said, like, she wanted me to put Kyle on the block, like I'll put him on the block. And, and so, I, yeah, I get how Kiefer might see that as me this week. Mm-hmm. Like if he sends home Austin. Mm-hmm. But like if that's not something we want to do, that's not something we want to do right now. But like at the end of the day, you guys aren't gonna be the ones that want to take the shot at Kiefer because if you if you're being boys with him and then you turn on him like right, that's like thing, he's yeah. fucking he he doesn't understand exactly. he doesn't exactly he doesn't understand that part right like that would look bad on us for sure yeah 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 it looks like we used him in the backstab and then like, uh, I mean with Oz I'm not sure where he stands with her but like they've never been tight tight right yeah. so it's just like maybe he takes a breath in jury and she gets to the end and mm. with me he ain't voting for me <laughs> I mean, it's true it's fair <laughs> for sure yeah so. Okay, yeah, that's fair, I guess. Um, so where do you stand with Austin and, and Brayden? With Austin and Brayden? Yeah. Honestly, like, I, I like them as people. I like hanging out with them. and um, I mean, one of me and Oz are going this week, so everything kind of changes now. Mm-hmm. 
I don't know which one of it is going to be, but. Um, so is there any reason why we should be skeptical of having Austin? As me this week, mm -hmm. like if he sends home Austin, mm -hmm. but like if that's not something we want to do, that's not something we want to do right now. But like at the end of the day, you guys aren't going to be the ones that want to take the shot at Kiefer because if you if you're being boys with him and then you turn on him like right, that's like thing, yeah. he's fucking he he doesn't understand he yeah. doesn't exactly he doesn't understand that part right like that would look bad on us for sure yeah 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 it looks like we used him in the backstab and then like, uh, I mean with Oz I'm not sure where he stands with her but like they've never been tight tight right yeah. so it's just like maybe he takes a breath in jury and she gets to the end and mm. with me he ain't voting for me <laughs> I mean, it's true it's fair <laughs> for sure yeah so. Okay, yeah, that's fair, I guess. Um, so where do you stand with Austin and, and Brayden? With Austin and Brayden? Yeah. Honestly, like, I, I like them as people. I like hanging out with them. and um, I mean, one of me and Oz are going this week, so everything kind of changes now. I don't know which one of it is going to be, but... Um, so is there any reason why we should be skeptical of having Austin in the game? Like, I, know, I don't want you to, like, obviously you don't have to tear it down, but I'm just wondering, like, yeah, yeah. like why is she detrimental to us more than you kind of thing? You know what I mean? Yeah, I don't think, I don't think she's detrimental to you guys. Mm -hmm. But I think at the end of the day, it's like, who's a bigger target? Who's caused, you know, who's, who's done shitty in comps? Me. Mm -hmm. Who's been part of two of the blow-ups for me mm. it's like i'm probably going to be used in a lot of different scenarios if different people went hoh as being on the block and that leaves only one other space watch i'm fine with if i stay in this game right. and like i said in the hoh if next week it's i don't know what the comp is probably an endurance one coming up probably but like building, yeah. yeah probably like if it's me you and you in the, at the end of the comp, like, you keep me and you want me to drop, fucking have your HOH. Right. Because, like, like I tried to sell a Kiefer before. That, that's why I got so frustrated after the noms because I was like, I'm a good guy of, like, you scratch my back. I, I'll scratch your back. Right. And I truly meant it. So when he didn't do it, I was like, fuck you, man. Like, I was actually serious. Mm -hmm. Right. Kind of thing. Right. So, like, I actually mean it when I say scratch my back, I'll scratch your back. You need something for me, you got it. And, like, yeah, I'm not going to tear down Oz or yeah, anything. But, obviously not. Um, I'm, just, I'm just a big target in this game where you guys need targets. A big target who hasn't won comps. Who hasn't, who's got fucking felled fourth in both of them. Right. It's like, right. you know what I mean? Okay. Like, Kiefer... Kiefer is always gonna have that personal thing against me. Yeah. If Kiefer wins, I and Ro will probably go up. Um, I don't know where Vic stands with me with from what happened. I might, I may go up. Mm -hmm. Tina and Tara, I have no idea, and that's why the wishy-washy, what you guys have been saying, like that kind of scares me. Right. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, it's like. Yeah, I just think our thing, like visually, was that, especially with last week's events, uh -huh. we just thought that like, visually you had all these people with you. So that's why we were like... Like Braden Austin? Yeah. Vic. Like we just assumed like Braden Austin, Tina Tara, like you kind of had them in some kind of set thing. I, I yeah, I just think t t with Tina and Tara, I honestly just think they're fucking hilarious <laughs> to be around. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Just as a duo. Yeah. Um, but no, like if, if I won, I, I don't know, I gotta go talk to Ro about where his head's at with he if he won. Mm -hmm. But... Um, like we talked about before that HOH, like the wishy-washy players, it's scary yeah. to see them. Because, like, fuck, dude. Honestly, how many times did they flip-flop back and forth in the row, almost mm -hmm. flip? Like, they mm -hmm. changed their mind nine times. So many that's kind of scary. So many times. That's kind of scary. And, like, play nice, but, like, that's pretty scary. Right. I know. To have. I think it's even, I, I literally think it's inevitably going to happen this week again. You know what I mean? Yeah. Just, like, almost every time, like... Yeah, it's weird. Like there's it's already people, football, like, there's so many people that are on both sides right now. <laughs> well, and, and one reason I didn't, like, campaign until today is that I was kind of told, like, the writing's on the wall by, like, almost everyone. And yeah. so I was like, okay, like, I just got to have a couple days, think about it. 
think yeah. about it, think about it. And then I kind of heard that maybe there's some conversations going on. So I was mm-hmm. like, oh, fuck yeah. Like, I, I, I definitely want to be here. Yeah. Like, 100%. Well, yeah, we didn't, like, we literally thought you were going to just, like, lay down and die. But, like, in our heads, we were speaking and we are just like, you do have a great campaign yeah. to stay. Like, yeah. You do. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, like, it would be very stupid not to use it. Yeah. Just at least see, you know? For sure. Because I think a lot of people, as, as cute and nice as she is, a lot of people are scared of Austin. Well, she's, she's really good, yeah. Yeah, she's good at comms. She's good socially. Like, she has, you know, uh-huh. she's, um, she hasn't really showed where her, like, allegiance is. So, there definitely are conversations going on about that. So, it's like, I mean, it's at least nice to hear that, you know, you do want to stay. Yeah. And, like, there are things that we could potentially work on. And then I know, I know, like, Tara's been on your radar. I'm not sure about Tina. But, like, at the end of the day, in the next HOH, and honestly moving forward, even though I know I haven't done well in comms, who would you rather have as, like, your frontline soldier? Me or Keeper? Because, like... Right. <laughs> right. Yeah. Right. To be honest. Like, straight up. Yeah. No, absolutely. <sighs> so... Yeah, that just makes sense, logically, yeah. Like, yeah, they'd probably be absolutely cheesed. <laughs> <laughs> like, yes. Like, Brayden would be because fucking we're close. Yeah. pissed. Yeah. What, like, what do you think Brayden would do? If Austin went home? Yeah. I think he, I, I, I think he's a logical guy. You know yeah. what I mean? I think, I think there are some people here that just aren't logical, and those are the scariest people. Right. I think Brayden yes. would be like, you know, his pissed off for a day just yeah, like anyone would on. but then move on just like you guys did with Latoya right mm-hmm. well if you don't do that you're gonna get left and left mm-hmm. behind mm-hmm. I think anyways yeah. but yeah I understand that yeah like I mean our, our biggest concern really was just like just obviously being filled our head filled with like Kyle and Rourke 100% gunning for you guys if they stay they have like to be who? broken up <laughs> just I don't know like you've heard that right 100%. You know what I'm saying? So, like, yeah, that's weird. literally our only thing. Like, oh, we, shit, we might as well get one of them out. If they're both counting for us, then yeah, that's for just sure. one less person. Like, I I'm, mean, hearing, I'm hearing during Vic's HOH, it's like fingers being pointed at my direction specifically. Right. Like, well, I think, they, I think they told you that, right, if you used the veto? Yeah, well, yeah, Vic just said, like, everyone, like, all, like, pretty much those people that voted for Latoya to go, so it's six, uh-huh. six people, were just all telling, telling her to put Kai up as a back door and let me use the veto blindly. No. So that's why. Oh, oh, you didn't know who was gonna put up. Um, well, I was just gonna use the veto because I thought she would, might just put up like a pawn or something. Yeah, yeah. And then, then she tells me that if I take him down, if I take her down, Ty is going up. So okay, that's so yeah, why I said my hands were tied because yeah, I couldn't yeah. use it. Yeah, yeah. But then she just said that like that's that idea was her. given to her by like pretty much you guys. Not, not by me, Earl. Yeah. No. I'm not sure exactly where it originated because we're not all in the room at the exact same time. Right. But. So it's, like, hard for me to say a name. Right. But, yeah, that was there was murmurs that... I mean, I heard the same thing you did. If you used it, Ty was going up. So I was like, oh, he's not going to use it. Yeah. Yeah. But... So that um, was, like, our... That was obviously our concern. And then just, like... And who knows? Maybe she was saying that, too, just so... Cause she, it could have been did, a bluff. Just because you didn't... So you didn't use it, you know? Yeah. No, no, could have been. been a bluff. But, I, but that was part of my concern, because it's, like, that week I remember seeing you, Ro, Austin, Braden... Mm-hmm. in here mm-hmm. having lots of conversations with it mm-hmm. so naturally i'm gonna think well yeah it's that relation like where is that coming i was just pumped because it was her and keith at the end and i just exposed Kiefer sly about her so i was like no way <laughs> 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 i was looking at the podium being like are you fucking kidding what, no, a, what a storybook that is actually just that actually is wild <laughs> <laughs> that could have went way Ro- differently if you won Ro- Ro- said he was like sitting on the bench being like oh, okay like I don't think I go up if either one of these two wins. And he said he looked over at me, and I was just like this. <laughs> and he had no idea why. Because <laughs> I hadn't told him yet. Yeah. I was just sitting there like this. <laughs> that is hilarious. <laughs> but, um, I don't know. Is there, is, there, is there a fucking opportunity here for me to stay? Or, like, what do you guys think? I think there is. I based on the conversations that, that are happening, yeah. Because yeah. I think, it, I, honestly, I honestly think it's in your guys' best interest. Because there is another male in here who's like an athletic guy that has had a target on his back, has had things true or false, mostly false, spread about him since day fucking, since Pretty Boys. Right. And it's been like constant every day. Most of them false. Right. So like, you, well, it's like, like we've why, always not, been, why not keep me, right? Yeah, like we've always been 
like we love you like, I, like, yeah, like yeah. you know what i'm saying and like and like I, we all like we love like vibing with you having a good time and yeah. stuff and it's just like it's something that we always say we're like fuck like why does he have to be coming for us like that's what, that's that, what going but that, that's from that's them what, i know like you know? never i don't know who it's you've never shown or said that but like in our heads we're just like man like this would be like good yeah. thing to do work with well it's like why does he have to be coming for us that's like our only whole thing so it's just like it, it does change things if you are like literally telling us yeah i'm not. not i'm not i'm not yeah and i mean it'd be a complete lie for me to say that me and ro haven't thought the same things about yeah. like are they coming are they coming for us right. like, should we get one of them out first right before they get one of us out right like that is I'm, that would be a lie to say. No, you have like, to think about it because it's just like an. Because like we get told the same thing that you yeah. guys get told about us. Yeah. So it does get in your mind. But I think it goes back to what we kind of had that conversation for. Is like the people that are scared to take shots at us mm -hmm. want us to be take shots against, at each other. Yeah, to take shots at each other. So I think I think this is a chance to be like, nah, you guys aren't getting in our heads, mm -hmm. and then we can take to sh those shots at the Tina Terrors of the world. Mm -hmm. And honestly, I'm I'm if I'm in this game, I. This might be stupid to say, or it might be genius to say that eventually I'm going to take a shot at Kiefer. But I, I genuinely do think that's good for you guys. Because, yeah. because fucking four people don't get to the end. Two do. Right, right. So to have a vote, because I don't think there's any chance in the world if you guys fuck Kiefer over that he votes for you. Oh, there's no way. No, no. There's no way. There's Z like, no way. Yeah, there's no way. Where I think, like, you know what? You... <laughs> Like I said to you yesterday, like I respect the game. I don't like it, but I respect it. Yeah. Before, I, before I knew Austin, line. before I knew Austin was going up. Yeah. Right. Like you know what? If we do this thing, and at the end of the day, like you guys do a fucking great move that I do not see coming, and I'm fucking sent to the jury house. Mm -hmm. I go, I fucking am in rage walking out the house, <laughs> and I go to the jury house, and I'm like, wow, I respect the hell of it. Yeah. Kiefer right. does not do that. Right. So I'll fucking I'll fucking take the bullet of Kiefer not voting for me. I don't care. Right. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, and that's like a huge thing actually. Like when, once it gets to the, the down to the jury, well, actually this week and next week mm -hmm. are like imperative for who you don't want in the jury. Yeah. You know, because yeah. you want like rational people in the jury, people that aren't emotional. You yeah. know, and like, I mean, I guess you can say that like Austin has been very emotional. Mm -hmm. And like, how do you know? Like, like who knows? what she would do in there you know mm -hmm. what I mean mm -hmm. so there's definitely that element yeah um, whereas like you obviously know the game and your respect moves and stuff like that like it was just even the way you reacted yeah like even yeah like <laughs> I, you I knew him. you guys knew what was going on when I said that to you in the room I knew like I knew like but I didn't honestly want to say it because I wanted to wait for the my little time at the POV yeah. ceremony yeah. but mm -hmm. I, I was being truthful like I respect it mm -hmm. I fucking respect it mm -hmm. We, it's the same thing we we said last week, honestly. Like with the toy, like as much as we hated it, we respected it yeah. because it really did put me in a terrible situation where either I could use it and take a risk, yeah. or I just don't use it, and then uh, someone that we were close with that's strong goes home. Uh -huh. Any smart player makes any that smart move. player makes that move. Hundred yeah. percent. We were literally yeah. saying like you guys would be dumb not to make this move. Uh -huh. So hundred percent respect. And, and those like, are the kind of people you want in the house. People that can actually like respect the game. Yeah. yeah. And not just be petty and mad. It, yeah, it does give me anxiety, like that row week week two flip where, like, we thought Teen and Tara were a hundred percent voting to Rick Josh, and it felt like they changed their mind fifty fucking times. Where I'd be like, "What are we doing here? Yeah, what yeah. are you guys doing?" Yeah, yeah, and it was like it was just like too much. Yeah, where it's like, I know where you guys were. I knew that there's obviously conversations like mm -hmm. what's happening right now, mm -hmm. and it seemed like you considered it. Mm -hmm. You said, "Nah, mm -hmm. not for us." And then you made your decision. Yeah. With them, he was like, tuff, tuff, tuff. well, yeah. I hope, and I hope that I, I do think Ro knows that, but I hope he like still like he still thinks that, you know? Because like, he does. yeah, because like we like obviously entertained the conversation, heard it out, but then we we're just like, nah. Yeah. And then like the the the, the flip flopper people or the ones See, that really wanted to happen. And we can we can like so we get told the opposite, obviously. Yeah. That, like yeah. you guys are running the deal, but like we know that logically thinking when we think about it to ourselves we're like nah yeah. there's no way that that is true yeah. so that's why we don't even like <laughs> like, like what I've been told mm. hey I'm just peeing and then I'll let What's you cooking? <laughs> all right, all right. but yeah like the shit I get told I don't even like when it makes no sense I kind of just go like it's actually it's getting to a point where it's like ridiculous no toilet yeah. paper the stuff I'm hearing about like myself like what I'm saying like I haven't said any of that like what <laughs> just like 
Like, what did I hear yesterday? Like, oh, like, um, apparently, like, Austin was like, our number one target. Yeah, me, and, me, and, me and Ty, we, we ran this whole HOA, we told Keeper what to do. What, what else did we hear? Who'd you hear? That we, like, pretty much ran this entire, like, we made Keeper put Austin up. See, that's the thing. Oh, I know. I don't know who it's. Like I don't know piece. who's starting it. Because I don't think it's you guys. It's not me and Ro, and like it's n it's not Brayden. <laughs> <laughs> it's not me, or it's not Austin. Because me and me and Austin have legit heard we're coming after each other since like day four. Like Kyle's number one target's Austin. Austin's number one target's Kyle. Jeez. And we kind of like laugh. But. Um, so, I mean, it leaves out little common denominators of the, the wishy-washiness of right. who's starting all the shit. Right. Right. So. And, I mean, if you guys want to take that shot in the HOH, like I said, and I'm, it's us three at the end, mm. you want me to draw, fuck it. But if you want me to take that shot, I'm happy to do it. Yeah, yeah I mean, our plan has always been the same. We wanted you to be in jury from, that's why we sat down and had that conversation. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right? This week, obviously, it seemed like you didn't, you were kind of like, I want Austin to say, forget it. Like, it felt like you were just like, I did, did she, she didn't really campaign much till today, did she? I spoke to her yesterday. Yeah, I spoke to her yesterday, yesterday yeah. as well. But I mean, I, I think hers was more like assuming mm -hmm. that, that she, I was gone. That you were gone, yeah. So it was, al it was almost more like a, are we, good? Like, are we still good? Yeah, so it is tough to like be in conversations where it's like planning ahead of next week when I'm not here. Right. But now that I'm having conversations with more people, I think I have four votes right now. Yeah. And that leaves you two and best vote. And I don't know. I mean, no matter what happens, Braden's voting to evict me. Yeah. Rose voting to evict Austin. Right. Right. So you just need to. Like, so. Well, I guess you need, need four, four more. more. Just so it's not a tiebreaker. I don't know where Kiefer's head's at. Right. That's kind of like a risk. I think Kiefer would probably vote to evict me. But um, I don't know if I should have a conversation with him, too. Like, what do you guys think? Probably. I would say yes, because I do think that he is, like, not 100% sure. Uh -huh. What know? do you think I should say to him? What do you think you should say? Yeah. I mean, it's, it's really about, for Kiefer, it looks like it's forward-looking, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. his, so, his worry is next week. Uh -huh. That's his biggest worry. So, but, like, that's the thing. I don't, who, would, like, who would he want next week? Who would he want to because, win? Or? No, like, who would he want out next week? Because he's close with Tina and Tara, right? Uh, I think like, you guys would have, like, different targets, I'm assuming. You three. Yeah. I mean... Let me see. There is. It's not Tina and Tara. I think that leaves. That leaves. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, I just need to go pee. No, oh, there's no toilet, toilet paper. paper. Okay, Beth just I'm went, not going to Beth pee just went to get some. Gotcha. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> um, yeah, I think it would leave Vic. But yeah, at the end of the day, like, if you guys. And the, sh and the shit you tell me, like, doesn't get back to anyone. Like, I'm not going to go to Vic and be like, Kiefer's targeting you next right, week. Right, right, right. You know what I mean? Because, um, I mean, and why would she even believe that? He could have put her up. Yeah. Um, at the end of the day, if you guys do want me in jury, you have the ability now to do it. Because I have four, I think. I think I have Ro. I think I have Vic, Tina, and Tara that would vote to keep me. Right. And that leaves one more. Right. I need... Yeah. Essentially. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you just need five to And go. then you guys coast through another week unless, I don't know, who do you think is going after you if me and Ro aren't? If you and Ro are here? Yeah. Or no, if, we, if they aren't. If, if we aren't coming after you, you know what I mean? Who goes up instead? No, who, like, who, yeah. do you, who are you scared of winning? Probably just Tina or Tara. Yeah. Yeah. So, yes. like, that's pretty fucking good odds. <laughs> 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 if we're here. That's true. And I think they think they're really comfortable. Yes. I would agree. Uh, yeah. So I can't even see them wanting to win, to be honest. That is true as well. Yeah. Unless, I mean, it does... unless maybe I go home. Then they go, okay, something's fucking going on here. Right. Like, we got to win here. Right. Ooh, well, I think they were hearing, like, I think someone told them that Austin was, like, going after them. Mm -hmm. So I think that's where their fear comes and where that's where their vote lies with you yeah yeah. you know yeah. what i mean and they seem to feel safe with you they, yeah. yeah they feel safer with you than with austin yeah yeah so they're worried that if austin were to win they would be up uh -huh. so i think yeah that's that's but here's my question why do they feel safe with you and like how could we all feel safe if we can't all feel safe with you 
You know what I'm saying? No, it, like, for sure. Me and Jed, Tina, and Tara all feel safe with you. For sure. That math doesn't really add up, and then who does that leave? I mean, I try to have, like, the personal relationships with everyone. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and at the end of the day, on that second week, Tina and Tara were my in to keep my number one. So I had to play the part. Mm -hmm. And I've just been playing the part right. ever since. You know what I mean? Right. And... Well, they were, like, the... Yeah. Hey, buddy. You fucking crushed me. Well, shoot. You guys need a minute? If you don't, if you yeah, don't mind. Yeah, it's like five minutes. Almost done. Gotcha. Thanks, brother. Mm -hmm. Um, but at the yeah. end of the day, like that's, the day, that's part of the game yeah, yeah. too. Like, you know. Like, yeah, like they they were they were definitely in the middle in that situation, uh -huh. right? Uh -huh. And like whatever. And like I think that shows that I'm that the I shouldn't feel comfortable with them either, because why the fuck would I feel comfortable with someone like hearing like little rumors and flip flopping on my number one constantly? Right. That's like I don't know. That's like Beth and Latoya for you guys when Latoya was still here. Right. That's like them being like flip flopping on one of you. Like one of you's up. And like right. all of a sudden they're coming to you and they're like, oh no, I don't think we should do it. Like I think we're voting Robo. And you're like, what the fuck? Oh shit. So like, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like two yeah. people you thought that you had. It's like, I don't, I think they're playing the part with me too. It's just like we're both mm. in that little standoff. No, I get it. It just, what, what, what's hard for me to register is that say say you need four or five votes for example mm -hmm. you have Ro mm -hmm. Tina Tara me and Jed mm -hmm. right how do how do me Jed Tina and Tara's interests all in all align for you to stay you, Tina's and Tara's don't but that's something I can't be telling them if I yeah, want to stay right exactly, now exactly yeah. so what you're saying essentially is that but you you'd have to pitch something to them in order to stay I, I just talk to them and it seems like they want me to stay mm -hmm. so I'm going to leave that at that and it felt like, so it felt like I had four and I need one more. I know you two are probably voting together. Right. I'm not sure about Beth, like her and Austin or, or Did what. you have to promise them targets? That's no. kind of what I'm getting yeah. at. That's yeah. what I'm wondering. Like, it, it. No, I think they do think that Austin's coming after them. And I just went, I, I, I have no idea. Yeah, they definitely think that. So you're saying it's not about you promising? Yeah, I'm I, think gonna go for about, I think it's more about her. No. I think it's more about her. But I'm staying out of the whole Austin stuff. Yeah, yeah. like I don't want to be involved right now. All you can do is right yeah, take campaign for yourself. Yeah. So yeah. I just said, yeah, I have no idea. Like, they're telling me, is Austin coming for me? I said, I have fucking no idea. Mm. So, so realistically, like, they're, so if we're talking about best interests, like, it may not be in their best interest to keep you, but it's not, that's not something you're obviously going to tell them. Yeah, for sure. But if it is our best interest to keep you, mm -hmm. that's something that's, like, legit, is yeah. what you're saying, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah. You know what I mean? Because you could also be telling us it's in our best interest, but. Yeah, I mean, I'm not having this deep of a combo right. or along with a combo with them. You yeah. know what I mean? Okay. Because I know how they get so goddamn paranoid about everything. And it's well, just, yeah. it's just, it's frustrating to me. Well, yeah. It's like, like Tara's extremely paranoid right now. Like, I don't <laughs> actually, I don't actually know who told her Austin's coming after her or if that has any merit. Someone could just go up to her and be like, man, saying. this chick is super paranoid. Let's just drop something on her. Yeah. No, that's <sighs> like a good move. <laughs> like, it is yeah. because that's, that's literally one person voting, yeah. the two of them. So, yeah. Because like they've they've shown that they just they get in their head so so much. Yeah, yeah, I agree with that. So like, why wouldn't you do that? I guess, but I, I I'm confused of who did that because it seems like whoever did that want, wants me to stay. <laughs> like it wasn't Ro. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> so I don't fucking know. I don't know what's going on in this house. Yeah, I don't know, man. <laughs> it's a lot of he said she said. Yeah, it's a lot of he said it's she said. Reality. Yeah, but yeah, like I'm. That's where I'm at, and like. Yeah, I just think at the end of the day, it's like, at least the thing that we've we've spoken about is like between you and Austin, mm -hmm. like you have always at least kind of shown, like given your intentions mm -hmm. and like shown where you're playing at, mm -hmm. whereas like Austin hasn't. Yeah. So it's like, we really don't know where she's at. Yeah. Like she was just in here before you and like, and I asked her like, who would you, like who would you target next week if you won? Yeah. And like, she still can't tell me someone. Yeah. So it's just like, how can I be sure that it's not us, you know? And I'm telling you guys. At least you're you. telling us. Like, you could be lying, but, like, at least you're saying it. Yeah. Whereas she won't even say that, and you know? I, and, and I'm truth, like, truthfully, if you do not, if you need me to have a week to prove it, yeah. fucking take the HOH. Yeah. You know what? Put me, fucking put me up. I'll win veto. I'll take myself down. Send yeah. someone else home. Yeah. Yeah. 
Well, yeah. honestly, like, because, like, seriously, like, when we talked to you guys before the HOH, like, that was, like, a genuine conversation. And, like, mm -hmm. when I was picked to play that veto, I genuinely wanted one of you guys to win. Yeah. Like, well, I was po that's why I was so popular yeah. for a while, because I was like, oh, it seems like everything's. So. Yeah, like, it was going well. Mm -hmm. Like, there was a point where me and Ro were at the same point. Yeah. You know what I mean? And yeah. I was like, let's think about this for a second. Like, I think it would better, it'd be, at the end of the day, like, if you guys stuck to your word, I was like, this would be in our best interest uh -huh. for you guys to say. Uh -huh. It's just unfortunate that Keith decided to put up her. Yeah. So. The way she goes, but. <laughs> yeah, it's the way she goes, but at the end of the day, you just got to look after yourself. Mm -hmm. but, and, like, uh, that's why I'm not coming in here trashing her, because I think, like, it, I mean, I'm, I learned my lesson with Vic, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> But, yeah. Um, like, yeah, like, I, I obviously, I, like, enjoy being around her, and yeah, I, I, and it sucks that either way, it's one of us goes. Yeah. I'm not going to make it be me that stays by tossing her under a fucking semi, but mm -hmm. I do want to stay. Mm -hmm. And I want, just want you guys to know that you two are now, like, the swing. Right. Like... I know you don't control Kiefer or you don't control Beth, yeah. but at the end of the day, I need one vote, and you two are tight. You guys are going to vote the same way. Right. Two votes. Right. Um, well, I yeah, we just want to hear at least how you wanted to be here, because we also didn't know for a bit there. 100. You know? I, think, I think after like everything that happened with Vic and then things get twisted too, and it's just like... You know, at some point, at, at, at that, I had, like, a fucking one day where I was just like, fuck, man, like, I feel like trash. But mm. at the end of the day, you know, you have a conversation, everyone loves each other. And mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You have a sleep, and you realize I'm in the, I'm in the big brother house, so yeah. I want to stay. Yeah. Want full experience. Um, you, always kn like, you always knew where we stood. Mm -hmm. like it, it really hasn't changed. The only thing that made it waver was us being uncertain about yeah, and I think what you we, wanted this week. I think we've all, like, me and Ro have been, like, we've always had that uncertainty with you guys, too. Like, we feel the same thing you guys are feeling. Right. Um, sometimes. Like, just because other people try to get in, in in our ears about it. Right. Like, I bet you we've heard your guys' name just as much or more than you've heard Absolutely. ours, Absolutely. About coming after us, so. Absolutely. And it makes you feel like a type of way yeah. about them, like, w without even talking to them. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. So it's like, I hear all this shit, and then I see you guys, and I'm just like, man, like, what the fuck? Like, snake. <laughs> But then I was like, then you talk, and well, I'd, like, no, I didn't say that. And people play the game too, right? So yeah. like, if people are coming to you and being like, I want Ted and uh, Ted. <laughs> that's our name. Bro. Yeah, Ted that's your name. Ted. Ted. <laughs> calling us Ted. Ted. No, yeah. no, no. I meant to say Jed, but that is a good that's name. That's a funny name. Um, Ted. <laughs> that's what I'll call you guys. You know. Um, but at the end of the day, if they're coming to us and. Like, you don't want to show your cards to everyone in the house. So if Tina or Tara, for example, are coming to us and being like, I'm not saying they did this. I'm just using mm. a duo as an example. Mm. Um, we want Jed and Ty. So we're going. We're obviously going, oh, okay, okay, yeah. okay. We're not going to be like, fuck no. No, it's Tina easy Tara. to say. It's easy to say to people, 100%, because yeah. it's just like the obvious. Yeah. Like, and I know that's probably what it is with you guys, too, because we're logical. It happens to us. People are probably coming to you. Yeah. Trying to say blah blah blah, Kyle Rowe, and you're like, oh yeah, okay, yeah, okay, exactly. Well, that's literally what uh, like Austin came in here, and that's what she said. She's like, oh, like you would, you would go after like Rowe, right? Like, if I stay, mm -hmm. I was like, oh yeah, 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 yeah okay, <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm. like I'm not gonna tell you anyone else. Like, I don't even no. know, you haven't told me anything. And that's what I mean. So like now, if that's not Austin, probably won't come and tell us that. But like if it's someone else, they come and tell us that, and mm -hmm. then yeah, that's where the seed of doubt happens. But right. they're doing it to both of us, right? Not Austin, wow. but like yeah, like other people in the house. I literally feel the like wishy yeah, like I feel like us and like you guys are getting the most information from people, uh -huh. just like about each other uh -huh. that isn't even true. No. So yeah. then it just like creates this like unneeded war. Like mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When like when whenever we have talks, like it's always pretty straightforward. Yeah. You know. Exactly. And then like these people all come and say all this shit, and it makes us, it makes us doubt it. And you're just like, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Yeah. But so you so you have talked to Tina and Tara. Just like briefly. Have oh, you talked to that? Yep. And she said she was down? Vic said she wants me here. Okay, so, f so that'd be f seven row. Okay, I so think it, comes down, it really comes down to what so you want. So it is, us too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Unless I'm getting the wool pulled over my eyes and people are just telling me that. But it's like, why tell me that when, like, yesterday I was just, like, kind of enjoying my time, right? Right, right, right. It's like, why even bring that up? Like, let, let them sleep if, if, 
if that's not true. Yeah. I'm curious too. I want to have some chats with some people too. Uh -huh. Yeah, I think so. Because like I'm hearing this and that, and flipping and flopping. It's like I uh -huh. want to. Well, that's what I heard today. I was like, because I I've been told like it's I, I was kind of laughing about it, like the conversations about like next week with that I'm not here. Mm. So it's like it's hard to campaign when you're hearing that. But then I woke up this morning and I'm hearing. Okay, people are, it's, yeah, like, it's happening things again. Things are moving, like, <laughs> no, seriously, it happens every time, it's wild. Yeah. And so I was like, well, fuck yeah, like, all right, I'm not going to say anything negative about Austin or no. why she, I deserve to be here better, more than her, because I think we all deserve to be here, mm -hmm. but at the end of the day, one person walks out the door, and you don't want it to be yourself. Question for you. Mm -hmm. You guys are, are you guys an alliance? Who? Cool. You, Austin, Braden, and, well, I, <sighs> I, I, I mean, like, me and Ro are in a lot. Obviously. <laughs> and then we develop connections, and I think everyone at this point talks game. Yeah. But it's not like... Like you're not named... Glued. Or... You know what I mean? It's right. not fucking glued together. Right. And for her to go is... It's, it, it's, it sucks for my game. Yeah. It sucks for my game to be honest, because I do trust her with game stuff. So yeah. if you want to call that an alliance, whatever. I, I my question would be, like, why not? You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, every, why not be an alliance if you guys are all close? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think I think I do talk the most game with them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So take sense. that as, as you will. No, no fair enough. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it's not even like you shouldn't be in one. Like, I feel, no. I feel like it'd be a good one. But, like, yeah. it's just for us, it's always just, like, her constantly denying it. Okay. So it's just like... That you guys never talk never game, talk never talk... It's like, it doesn't mm -hmm. seem realistic to me. It just seems unrealistic. To be that close with somebody mm -hmm. and never, never talk, talk game. game. Right. Mm -hmm. And like, that's what she has like, really harped on when she's been talking to us the last two days is like, we never talk game. Like, it's mm -hmm. only personal. And I just found that like, extremely hard to believe. Okay. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. Don't get me thrown under the bus. Like, I'm we're not trying to throw like, under the bus. Like, I just like, be real with me. Like... But like if you're campaigning for like if she's campaigning to us to help her stay, why would you just lie like that? Like that's clearly a lie. Like you don't you're not around people this much without talking anything. Yeah, you know? and you guys don't need me to answer yeah, that. Yeah, exactly. You're, no. you're smart guys. Completely fair. Yeah. Um, yeah, I just wanted to like ask you that though because I know you'll tell us at least. Like people talk game. We talk game with everybody. <laughs> yeah, like at this lie. point you talk game with everyone, right? Yeah. yeah. It's day twenty six. Like you have to. That's another thing I respect about you. When you do answer questions. You're being real, mm -hmm. in general. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm like, well, fucking keep me then, <laughs> pieces of shit. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck yeah. yeah I don't know, man. I think it's just like, like, I don't, and I, I just feel like, like, have you talked to Austin yesterday? No. Did you feel it was more just like a, an expectation? Yeah. You know what I mean? She's more like. She just, like, she doesn't actually I give me reasons you. why I should keep her. Mm -hmm. Whereas, like, you're giving, like, actual reasons. It's more like, I'm good with you. Yeah, she's just like, so we're good, aren't right? aren't you good with me? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know? But it's and like... I, I actually talked to her before this, too. Um, when I, like, kind of heard that things are talking, I just went up to her. I was like, hey, I think both of us need to just go campaign for ourselves. Yeah. I don't want you to leave the house being like, fuck, I didn't campaign against this guy. And right. I don't want me to leave this house being like, I didn't campaign for myself. So I was like, you go campaign for yourself, I'll go campaign for myself. Are we cool with that? She said, yeah. Absolutely. So, I mean, yeah. that's something I'll always kind of do to, with people I trust. And I hope you know that I trust you guys. And, mm. and hopefully I can stay. Yeah. Regardless, on Thursday, it's going to suck saying goodbye. It's like, goodbye. Mm. If, to, if it's to all of you guys, that's a little worse than saying goodbye to one person, obviously. Right, but it right. still sucks either way. Yeah, that's a shitty situation either way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you know, for us, it's hard either way. Yeah, I mean, you, you guys know? probably aren't going to like saying goodbye to me or saying goodbye to Austin. Right. Because you like hanging out with both of us. Absolutely. Yeah. But it's um, like, at the end of the day, it's going to suck either way. So it's just like which one sucks but is yeah. better for us moving forward as well. At the end of the day, I'm a, you guys are going to be targets forever. Right. Um, you knew that walking in here. I'm going to be a target forever. Right. It seems like for whatever reason, I'm a bigger target than you guys right now. In, their, in most people's eyes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just because of, I'm not afraid to speak my mind sometimes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and that can get me in a little bit of hot water. Yeah. But, <laughs> at the end of the day, that's good for you guys. That is true. And like I said, with the Kiefer thing, like, you're going to have to get rid of him at some point if you want it to be you two at the end. 
let me do it. Yeah, that's true. Eventually. All right, bro. All right, well, we're definitely going to, yeah, definitely going to think about it. All right, fellas. I'm trying to make, honestly, I'm trying to make this decision tonight. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because I'm not trying to have another there. Thursday crazy day. Yeah. That's you fine. Know? Yeah, and honestly, just let me know. Like, yeah. I can fucking take it as a, like a man if if not. I think it I think it truly is in your best interest for, interest for me to be here. Yeah. Yeah. I actually do. So. Leave it at that. And Great. Let me know, fellas. All right, my guy. Either way. Good to talk. <laughs> Uh, we're debating doing a comedy roast in We're doing a comedy roast in like an hour and a half. Of who? Everyone? Of your roast that you want oh, to who's getting roasted? Uh, like roast everybody? If you want, or just three, you know, there's no uh, pressure. We can't write anything down though, eh? Fuck. No. I threw you under the bus I so know. hard, dude. <laughs> so deleting. Oh man, we can't be friends after huh? this. Then. Why? Please? Fucking <laughs> liar. <laughs> what? You know what though? He came with more truth than Oz did. And he did. My chats with Austin go nowhere. Mm -hmm. My chats with Austin go nowhere. Nowhere. Like Talking in circles. Nowhere. She's like, well, you did it, and you did this, yeah, and well, exactly. you did that. I just trusted you. All she could say me? was that. Like, all she could say to me was like, I wouldn't put you up next to me. You show me loyalty, I'll show you loyalty back. I just like, it just, she doesn't like, actually campaign at all, though. She just says like, I trust that you guys will do like what, what's right kind of thing. You know? Why does she trust us? I don't know. Or why does she claim that she trusts exactly. us? More importantly. Exactly. What have we done to show her that she can trust us? I don't know. Nothing. She so always she's lying. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. That's the reality. It's like, fuck. Kyle's coming here with facts. facts. She's lying. Straight facts. But the reality is that who is better for our game to be here? I don't know if we can base it on who's a liar and who's not. Who's better for our game? I still think Austin's better for our game. Yeah. Because the reality is... Kyle never goes back up if we don't get him now. Well, not that he never goes back up, but like, if we don't put him up next week, no one's putting him up right. next week. Whereas, nobody really trusts Austin. Right. Like, we do know Tina and Tara are scared of Austin. We know that. So we know there's a good chance that Austin goes up next week. Right. If, she doesn't if we keep him. Kyle, they're not putting him up. And they may not even vote for him. Absolutely not putting him up. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. What's going on? What's up, bro? So it's like, man. Just you guys in here? Yeah. Mm hmm. I didn't even see Kyle leave. Just now. Oh. But it's like, yeah, he's speaking facts. He is talking facts. But the reality is, is like, for him to, for him to have Tina and Tara's vote, and then have mine and yours, what is he pitching to them, and how could he pitch to both of us? Yeah. And us all, and not be a conflict of interest. Yeah, Impossible. That is, that is a conflict of interest. There has to be. Did he? Was he making sense? No. Well, part of it was. Part of it makes sense. Part of it is just like, sounds like he's definitely promising too many people too many things. Um, obviously, his main pitch is just like, you know, he wouldn't come after us. And then just like, he's a bigger target right now in the eyes of the house. So obviously, he would be an easy person to put up. And then um, he would take like shots, like bigger shots. Or, he seems to think he has Tina and Tara's vote. Yeah, right. He thinks he definitely has their vote. Right. And then and Vic. And then it's he thinks he has Tina, Tara, Vic, and Ro. So he just says that we he needs us to swing the vote. But it's like, why on earth would Jed and I and Tina and Tara vote for you? How, what could you pitch us? Tina and Tara promised you their vote. But to be fair though, Tina and Tara were like being very. I know. I just talked with them this morning. What did they say? They said, hundred percent. Whatever I say, they'll do. Like, we don't technically need them. Because yeah. if it's me and you, Beth, and Vic, and Brayden. And Brayden. Me, you, Beth, and Brayden. Yeah. And we tie it. We can break the tie. And I'm sending Carlos cards off. Yeah. That's all there is to it. No, we don't need them. We don't need them. You, you also can't believe that he's not going to come for you. No. Impossible. That's their own. That's what we're always trying to rally the troops with. Yeah. Bro didn't even try to talk game with me once when we played chess. You know what though? A tie vote says a lot. Yeah, it does. It won't be tie. It won't be tie. If Tina and Terry here that we're all voting Kyle out, they will not. They will not be on the opposite end of it'll that be vote. A it'll be seven one. But if they think they have the numbers, would they go against you? No. It would be quite a test to see that though, wouldn't it? What? They won't go against me. 
that Tina and Tara would go against the house if they thought they had the house. I don't know what numbers they think they'd have, but. So, so for example, if Kiefer says, this is how I want you guys to vote, do they think that all of us are voting a different way? Do they keep their word to Kiefer? Oh, uh, as in like we go to them and say, no, let's do this. Yeah. I don't know. I think they come right back and tell him. Because why does Kyle think he has seen and Tara's vote? Did they tell him that? I don't know. He does, he he a hundred percent said that he he was like, I have Tina, I have Tara, I have Bro, and I have Vic. He said I need you guys to get me over the edge. I'm wondering we, we know he doesn't have Tina, Tara, or Vic. Yeah. Here's I mean, we know he doesn't have Vic. Yeah. Tina and Tara. Okay, so here's here's what I'm pitching in my mind. Is if that Tina and Tara are lying to me, that would ruin everything we've built on from day two. Yeah. My question is, should we put them to the test? That's what I'm getting at right now. How so? We as a house say we're voting one way. You tell them to vote for the person. So, for example, you tell them to vote out Kyle. Or vote for, you tell them to vote to evict. Austin. Austin, sorry. We vote to evict Kyle. You see where they vote? No, I'm not doing that. They would be pissed at me, and <laughs> everything I've built with them would be gone. They would be... Jeez. They would <laughs> fucking freak. No, it wouldn't be worth it. You're right. Not for my game, maybe for yours. No, it wouldn't be worth it for anybody. At this point, I'm, I'm game to just vote out Austin with all this talk. <laughs> <laughs> nah, don't vote out Austin. Because that benefits me the most. Out of everybody in this room, voting out Austin benefits me. Yeah. yeah so I just don't understand why it's still a discussion. Who's discussing? Us. Not really. I'm just, I'm just listening. I'm still on the same page. I'm always still on the same page. Honestly, what you just said there is what just brought me back. The fact what? that who was going to put them up. Exactly. If you don't get them now, who's going to put them no, up? No, who's going to put them up? Tina and Tara won't put them up ever. Never. No, ever. Austin and Brandon won't put them up. Exactly. No. No one's putting them no up. No one's putting them up. Be us and Vic. Vic. Vic would put them up. Us? But like, if we make this, like, if we make this truce, and we wouldn't. It's a bullshit truce. That's what I'm saying. It only goes one He's way. He's already up there. Take yeah. a shot. We'll get him to the next week. Yeah. There's so many people that will put up Oz, though. So yeah, we have to put Oz. We have to. Austin, Austin doesn't have Tina and Tara and all that. And part of Kyle's pitch is to come for Keith. Yeah. Part of his, yeah. Of course. Why wouldn't it be? His pitch is to literally take a big shot at Keith. But so that's the weird thing. Why are we we pitch, why is he pitching to us to come for you? It's probably one of the worst things he could have said. That's probably the worst thing he could have said. He literally said, I'll, I'll take the shot at Keith, so you guys don't have to. <laughs> I was like, brother, do you not know that would fucking work? Like, <laughs> that which confirms that they don't know shit. Yeah, they actually don't that know That is shit. fucking crazy to me. How, like, I'm like basically done hiding. I'm not telling anybody, but I'm like, you know what I mean? Like, how can they not tell me? No, that was weird. When he said that, I was like, ah. Lost me, brother. <laughs> He's like, if you guys take Keith out, he'll never vote for you in the end. So I'll get, I'll get him out for you. I have no idea how <laughs> fucking loyal I am. No, you're not hearing it. We don't want Keith out. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <I'm> idiot. <laughs> that was actually crazy. I was like, fuck. Oh, when you said that, I was like, ah, oh, you lost me, bro. It's over. So there's like. Did Tina and Tara tell him they're voting for him? Yes. Just to fuck with him? Yes. Why? Because they don't want to bat in that relationship because they were Just working in case. with they were working with Kyle and Roe. Just in case were. what? If they if they vote for him to go home. Because yesterday they were all about getting out Austin. But it's only them that's making that pitch. Exactly. So my question to you is why won't they just say, listen, we're voting you because out, Kyle? Vic also wants Austin out bad and they had talked to Vic. And Vic's just like, I don't give a fuck who goes. So Vic may flip is what you're suggesting. She's not gonna flip. She's grateful that who, we Who is voting out Kyle for sure? Us three? Or you me, guys bad? You, Beth? Braden. Braden. Four is for sure. Yes. So that means if worst comes to worst, you send him. You have to send him home. Yourself. I send him home. Especially after he told you that he's coming for me. Yeah. How the fuck could I keep him? <sighs> yeah, we're not oh, doing this. We're not doing this dancing anymore. 
really blatantly. The dance is over. So why don't we just vote our way for sure? Who? <laughs> now I go to Tina Tara and say, Kyle's pitching that he's just going to come after me now. Yeah, so the fate is sealed. They don't care. They care. I don't think, do you think so? Yes. You don't know them like I do. They sound like they care about them more than anything. Yeah. That's why they're pitching Austin in the first place. They also think that Austin is better for my game to go home now, which is true, but it's not better why? for Kyle. Why? Why? Because they know Kyle, and they know that Kyle isn't coming for me. He's coming for you guys. They know that. It's in stone. This is a last But Kyle game. has done nothing to prove that he can even win a competition, whereas Austin has. So Austin wins, there's a very good chance she puts you up. Me? Yeah. Exactly. Kyle, Kyle... Kyle wins. He puts you guys up. But he won't win. <laughs> but we don't know that. Yeah. It could be like one of those long things where you need long arms. You just don't know. We don't sure. know. It could be chance. No, it's fair. I know. He uh, could throw a ball and hit. Yeah. He could launch a ball and land on uh, the highest number. Right. You know what I mean? No, it's fair. Like, we don't know. I think, I think it's in our best interest to send Kyle home. It's in my best interest. Well, he did blatantly said that he was going to gun for you. <laughs> blatantly. He just said, like, if I get him out, then he won't be he won't be salty at you guys in the end for a vote. Why was, why was that part of his pitch? What a strange... Yeah. What up? Yeah, Beth is just being... She wants to come and check. That's cool. The high Sure. Yeah. yeah. How are you guys doing? Good, how are you? Like I've been seeing you guys all day. No. You're all ready. Come on. Yeah. I've seen you in that blue. Oh, yeah, you did. Mm. I, don't, I don't have a lot of blue. Now I'm spicy. I like how it goes with the pink, though. Yeah, it looks good with yeah, the pink. Yeah, it does, actually. Mm -hmm. Jeez. <laughs> I'm glad you think so, because I may or may not have been wearing this shirt for a certain photo shoot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't kill me. <sighs> All right, well, we'll just wait for Beth wants to talk. Yeah, she does. Well, yeah, we were just having a chat, and then we're like, we need to talk. What are you guys talking about? Um, <laughs> you know, <sighs> just talking about potential flips, I guess, seeing what, what the best move is. Mm -hmm. Everything comes to light, people start talking, and then it's just like, we just need to talk it out again. Absolutely. Communication mm -hmm. is key. Hey, baby. But I oh, already done a lot of talking today, so it's just like... Well, we've talked to both. Like, we've talked to Austin and we just talked to Kyle. So we were just kind of trying to break it down, but it's easier if everyone's in here. Because literally, the people here will control the vote. Yeah, it's <laughs> yeah so. Us here. Yeah. You didn't use a loofah? No, I don't have any body wash. You don't want it? You can use it. Do you want it? Throw some no. shampoo on there and rub it down. Look at this, bro. So, wait, what's in your shower shampoo? I have your smell. I'm holding this. <laughs> I gotta give it back tomorrow. Babe. Wait, to give back the loofah? Yeah. Oh, Are you sure? Shit. I don't know. No, no, I'm gonna hold on to this. They'll come look for it. They need it. They know where to find me. <laughs> They do, though. You know what I'm saying? You got nowhere to find me. Oh, Lufa. Right? Are you going to take that, you think? Yeah, I think so. Oh, shit. Did, you, did you use it? No. <laughs> Stop talking about it. And then just hold on to <laughs> yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. talking way too way much. Too let me hold yeah. on to this loofah. There's a drone in the sky. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They never would have known. They never would have known. Oh. <laughs> yeah, like shit. When they said we had to go inside, I was like, bitch. This is their office. Yeah. Mm. Uh -oh. well, obviously, people are making pitches. Kyle made a pitch. Austin made a pitch. Well, Austin made a pitch more so to Jed. Yeah. And I came in at the tail end of it. Um, and then Kyle made his pitch. Um, I mean, nothing in my mind has changed, really. I'm not learning any new information, to be honest, besides that Kyle's coming for Keith. It's really yeah. the newest information that we have. <sighs> I don't see anything changing. The reality is Austin is really untrustworthy. He says one thing, does another. We don't know where our head's at. We, we don't. I personally think Austin needs to go. I, just I agree. I think she needs to go next. Because the reality yeah, is, we'll never have Kyle back on the block. But I don't believe that. I think we more so have Austin. Name There's one thing that Kyle can beat you guys at. It's not even, it's not even the point. But who puts up Kyle besides us? Me. 
Me. What the fuck? Me. <laughs> Who puts up Austin besides everybody? No, I would. I'm too. I would. Don't think I could put up Austin. That's fucked up. That sounds scary. Why? Not scary, but like. I would never scary. straight up put her up. She'd be a back door, but I would yeah, never straight up put her up. She just scares the shit out of me. It would have to be like a back door. Kyle, look at how easy he's had on the block. Like you know what I mean? He's just like, easy put up. And that was part of his pitch to me. It's like, I'll go on the block. I don't care. I just, I'm, I'm a week by week type of guy. I don't like that he said he's coming after you, though. So I don't want you to be like, hey, bitch. Yeah, but like, so is Austin. Yeah, so is Austin and Bray together. Up there coming for you. But that means Kyle. Yeah, Kyle, Kyle that means Kyle and Ro. They're all coming for the same people. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Being real. Those four are just it's the same person. It's smoke mirrors, guys. Mm-hmm. I'm not the target. Here's the targets. On both sides, then. I'm they're telling you. Why are Austin and Bray stronger than Kyle and Rowe? I just because they are. They like, like physically, physically socially, they're, they're way better. All the HOHs, he was third last. But past comps don't necessarily show us what, how it's possible in future comps. It could be another Because they're different. Comp. Kyle's practicing his days. He knows him like hell. He's a super fan. That worries me myself. Braden hasn't Austin watched this. coming for me than Kyle. It put, okay, say, say you're on the other side of the house, and it's Jed and Beth up on the block, and now everybody just wants to get out Beth all of a sudden. You know what I mean? We just, he's the glue that keeps them together. That keeps who together? Roe, Brayden, Austin, they're weaker without him. Who does Austin have if she stays in this game? Brayden. Who does Kyle have if he stays in the game? Tina. Tara. Tara. Brayden. Bro. Brayden. Tina, Tina and Tara, the, the thing that's swaying me is that Tina and Tara would never put Kyle on the block. Ever. Exactly. But never. they would put Austin on the block in an instant. Yes. Mm. Why yeah. do you say you can't put Austin on? Okay, I, I'm not saying I can't, but I would. Like, I would. I just mean, like, I just mean it would be easier for me to put Kyle. Like, I would put her, but, like, she's just... It's just the same thing, though, like, as, like, you were playing... Tara, we are playing them. So we have to be very, like, individually, we have to be careful with who we put up. It would have to be a back door. Okay, so... I couldn't just straight up put them up. If we go back to the allies conversation, who has more allies if, allies if they stay? Kyle does. Mm-hmm. Clearly, there's no debate on that one. No if debate. you have Tina and Tara, what do you think? You don't think so? Not more than Kyle and Roe together. They're in a smokers group. We have Kyle is the most dangerous threat on the block right now. Yep. Okay. Yeah, I think it's so. Okay. I think he is. I think yeah, he is. If it comes down to yeah. the tie, I'm sending him out of his ass home. No, totally. No, because Tina and Tara promised me on their yeah. lives, on their ki- like everything they have, that I give them a name, they say it. Okay. And I believe them when they say that. I think we have a much easier time taking out Austin next week than we would taking out Kyle. As long as we're in agreement that she's the target next week, because I just feel so shit when I'm around her. Like, yeah. it's like untrusted. Like, you, I never know what's coming out of her mouth. Yeah. She still has a company. I know. It's and Eva, I just talked to Tina in the kitchen, and she's like, I don't know. Like, I think oh, I'd be too early for Austin. Like, I would just take the easy route and take Ro out next week. Mm-hmm. But she would have to feel like, she would have to know. Like, we'd have to have a conversation. Like, no, we're all thinking that. So maybe she'd be more comfortable with doing it. Who? Tina. Putting Austin up? Mm hmm. She said she'd rather just put Ro up? Yeah. For what? But I told her, I'm like, what about another duo, though? Exactly. So. Like, we need to stop getting them. Tina and Tara want Austin gone. Yeah, they want her gone bad. Yeah, they want her. If so, we, so if we said Nick, that. So how would Nick. You're close to Austin, Beth. Sorry? They think you're close to Austin, which is why they told me that. Yeah, I just had actually a good combo with uh, Tina, though, and I was pretty straight up. Why, why would next week be too early if they were down to send her home now? To do it herself. Oh. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to waver. Yeah, it's your choice. I'm, I'm setting stone. If okay. you guys want to do no. anything else, I mean, I'm game. But this, again, Austin, well, I don't know now. Now that Kyle says he's coming for me. <clears throat> it makes it a little bit easier in my mind. Because even just saying that. I don't think their targets are very different between the two. What I, I really do know don't. is who's who's stronger in the game if they stay? Kyle. A hundred percent. hundred percent. They get power 
Dean and Tara vote wherever Kyle wants. They don't vote wherever Austin wants. Austin has won one comp. I ain't one. I ain't stressing the vote. Yeah, no. We're giving it too much credit. Like way too way much. Too it's much. And at least we know that like it's different if like someone's a great liar and is making you believe it. But like we know she's lying. Like so it doesn't and even she's matter. Like making shit up like crazy. Yeah. I know. I know. I know. Yeah. I know. The last thing I want us to do though is to get emotional about Austin because we're all feeling no, 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 we're no. all feeling the same trust. No, yeah. I'm voting O'Kara. Yeah. Fine, trust. I just want to make sure we're in agreement that next week. Do you have and if and if okay, so I talked to Austin for like a while, and I was trying to get her to like say names and shit. She asked me like, because I was like, okay, tell me names. Who would you put up next week? Um, and she like still wouldn't. And then she started. Why does no one have a target in week four? I know, but she still. Then she started saying like Tina and Tara. Um, she made me say a name, and I just said I said Rowan Vic. So just so you know. Okay. Just you so said Rowan Vic. Yes. Okay. Thanks for letting me Obviously know. Obviously, I would not forgive her. Thanks for letting me know. <laughs> I would, of course, I. She could be like Jen's throwing you under the bus. Thanks for letting me know. I just had to give her names. Of course. Just, you know, but you know, I was just trying to see where her head's at. Yeah, throw off the set. Yeah. Okay. But, but um. In, in, in judging both conversations I had with them, like obviously Kyle's the more honest one. Kyle admitted that they're in alliance pretty much. Austin's still like, we never talk game. Why don't they just say it? Kyle did admit that they Kyle, were. Kyle did admit it. He's like, we talk game. If you want to call us in alliance, it's fine. Yeah, and then, and then he's like, like he, he's like, you guys are smart. You should see like who's who's telling the truth here. And we're like, yeah, we know. But Austin still keeps saying, we've never talked game. It's always personal. Just say it. <laughs> we literally say see it. you in rooms yeah. together. Just say yes. It's so annoying. Just say it. Yeah, okay. I don't know why she thinks that, that she's hiding that. She annoys all of us, but her time is coming. Yeah. I promise. She just cannot go to that fucking jury house. We will be fucked. I can't have an, a mad Austin injury. Yeah. No. Well, that's like, what she said to me, too. She's like, I just want to make it to jury. No. No. In my back of my head, I was like, if she wins next week, she's in jury. Yeah, I know. That's, just that's, a, that's a huge risk. One in nine chance she wins. <laughs> One in eight? Eight. Eight. No, it's, it's nine. Oh, no, it's two. That's crazy. I still take those chances. I take those odds. We're at a game where we're afraid of Austin and Braden. <laughs> like, that's a good spot for us to be in. I agree. Like, I'm just not afraid. Okay, but don't underestimate them. They're not like shit, complete shit players. Oh, like they're actually yeah, still. Well, not, but I just it's... pick my side. You haven't like visibly. You think that you haven't picked her. Like they know you're working with these guys because Kyle knows. You're well, if team. someone doesn't think I'm working with these guys, then they're out to lunch. They still don't. They still don't really think. Like Kyle's telling us about the numbers he has, and he's like, he's like, I know you guys vote together. Like I don't really know what Beth's doing. I know I don't know what Vic's doing, and. Like, he, he just like he doesn't think that you're like. Don't worry, I'm voting where whatever. Don't you worry. Good, it's all good. good yeah. We're just gonna gun for this HOH like no other. If I'm, I don't know why I said that. If I win, I'm putting up Brian Austin. I don't know why I said that. Yeah. Because it's not true. I am. Yeah. And, yeah. I, and I have a reason to as well. Like I have, I'm totally fine with that. Yeah, that's fine. Like you don't talk to me at all. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, exactly. Like have you guys ever seen me talk to Brian Austin dead ass? No. <laughs> not since your HOH. The only thing that just like put like like obviously it's emotional like it pisses me off about Austin is like at least Kyle came in here with like straight facts and he's like if I stay this 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 and this whereas Austin just came in and was just like we're good right like you're gonna show me like your mm. loyalty and I'll show you mine yeah that's weak she didn't say any pitches as to why exactly. she benefits my game at all that's her game I know Austin's game is to oh I'm so innocent and yeah. cute and mm -hmm. just feel me and I got you and, like she literally said that too. she literally said that. She's like, I'm, she's like, I'm nice, I'm cute, I'm like, I'm not I'm innocent. Imagine saying that. I'm like, play on your emotions. Ew, yeah, imagine saying that. <laughs> imagine saying that. Oh, gosh. She is sick for that. She'll play on your emotions. Yeah. You'll think she has your back. And you said she does the face. The yeah. Switch, she she did the switch in here when I was HOH. -H. It was fucked. <laughs> No, I don't want to say we're underestimating them. I just want to say that they're, they're strong good. competitors, those two. Definitely. But I'm betting. I'm betting on. I'm betting on us first. Versus them. I'm betting on six of us. I would just. I can potentially versus win mm -hmm. versus three of them, which can potentially win. I'm just like going yeah. into a competition. It's I feel a gamble. Like, yeah, but, uh, it's a gamble. We just are making. I mean, it's a gamble either way because it's a huge gamble. Like, I just after what Roe has said to you, knowing how tight he is with Kyle, do you think Kyle wouldn't come after Ryan Jett if he was HOH? I don't know. Yeah, the nice thing if Kyle goes is like, if Ro thinks that we're wild cards and he like brings us in, mm -hmm. he won't do that if Kyle stays. Right. Right? Like yeah. he'll just be like, fuck it, I don't need you guys anymore or whatever, you know? For sure lose Tara and Tina. 
Yeah. If Carl stays. Yeah. He keeps them. He, he keeps, keeps them. them. And they're yeah. four. And yeah. then they're keeps them close. At least. To five. Even okay. though he told us that that was oh, the, yeah. he told us that was, he pretty much told us that was a fake relationship. He's like, I, I, I used them. He, said, he pretty much said he used them for your HOH. And then since then, he just Can been like, staying. Yeah. He's been he staying. Tried. He tried everything. He tried to get into a five person alliance with me, him, Ro, Tina, and Tara. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. It was unorthodox five of everything. Yeah, these words like, we can make it to the final five. No. Sorry, the final five sitting right here, first of all. Yeah. Right. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyways, that sounds good to me. Yeah, sounds like, good. Again, sure. yeah, absolutely. Hey, I'm voting with you guys no matter what. Tonight we're gonna like just set it in stone, and nothing's gonna be said tomorrow. Yeah, no, that's me and nope. Gina said. Really, I'm gonna be tonight, working on my hair PM. tomorrow. Nope. 10 p.m. tonight we're setting it in stone. It's over. Sounds good. Yeah, like, don't even, don't even I'm fucking not talk even about listening. it. I'm not listening to anyone tomorrow. That's not yeah, don't even look at me. <laughs> yeah, we're not over. Don't even. We can't overthink. Remember, don't touch me. You're gonna have to. That's gonna be you tomorrow, Kiefer. Twerking up the stairs. <laughs> oh yeah. Tough act to follow. Yeah, it is. I don't think I'm gonna do that. <laughs> You're not twerking <laughs> up the stairs, big man. No. Oh. I got no ass. <laughs> Just like my back down to my balls. You know what I mean? <laughs> Booties. Let's do. Sounds good. Okay. Honestly, like, I don't think there's anything that can be said to me today that would change my mind. Yeah. I don't know what new information could come up for me to be like. Yeah, there's really nothing. I, yeah, as long as we can all say that we can put her up. Like, I just feel like she's one of those people who won't go on the block. Like, Austin, she has that face. She cannot be real. Yeah, exactly. You know what I mean? Like, that's dope. That would be a sick fucking move. Yeah. yeah, that would be pretty dope. Break up two doubles in two back to back weeks. Pew, pew. Right? Story. Yeah. Sounds good. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good chat, good chat, we'll, good chat. We'll conglomerate again. Later. Yeah, we'll talk tonight. Yeah. I'm working on my roast. It's probably 45 minutes. Oh, yeah, it's gonna, we're going to do that Wait, soon. Who are you roasting? We're all She's doing not like a roast. Roast He's got roast. Just one person? Three, no, no, like me, I think bro. You just go up and say, you just roast everyone roast. You, oh. I'm doing three, like a three jokes. Like, oh, okay. Like wow. three joke rows, so you guys better get oh make some God. up. I thought of one. I don't even know if I Yeah, well, it doesn't have to be three. I just I have three. He's <laughs> bigger <laughs> laugh. We we'll just do straight up stand up. <laughs> hey, all y'all doing tonight? <laughs> yeah. Just do one of your dad's, one of your dad's <laughs> jokes. Dude, I'm gonna leave after that roast. I'm gonna have enemies. Good. <laughs> enemies. Take me down. This is also like, yeah, I'm gonna say roast. I'm roasting you guys. Jed, you don't want the smoke. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want the smoke. I'm different. I'm different. Oh, man. How you feeling? I'm different. No. Good. Go on. I told them my targets would be Tina and Tara. Really? Yeah. You think they believe that? I went and told Tina and Tara as well. We're going to say that we built enough trust with Tina and Tara that, he would, that they would likely vote for Kyle to stay. However, Tina and Tara and Kiefer are all emotional players in this game, and if we take them out in the jury house, then they're less likely to vote for us because they're going to vote emotionally and not vote. I think a big reason that they want you gone is because they think you're working with Tina and Tara, and that they, mm -hmm. like, their thing is that if you stay, you have Ro, Tina, Tara. If Austin stays, she has Brayden. Mm -hmm. That's their thing. Mm -hmm. Welcome to the BB Can Roast. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Tashan, I got two already. Two roasts. Two roasts. <laughs> it's, it's a surprise. Right? They're gonna be fucking funny, too. You gonna roast me? Uh, I don't have one for you yet. But I got uh, a combo of Jed and Beth. And then. Time and Beth? No. Jed and Beth. And then... We're working on them. Are you gonna do like how many? Uh, I think like three different jokes <laughs> per person. Like every, like no, 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 like everyone who's going, everyone who's doing a roast has to do three jokes. Does everyone have? Like, yeah, one person. Does yeah. everyone have to do it? <laughs> no, not everyone has to do it. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna yeah. I'm not good at stand-up shit. 
Yeah, I think as much as you can. Try to not throw her under the bus. Well, I'm not gonna throw them under the bus. I'm just gonna say that Austin and Brayden are in a really good position in this house, and we just have to play the part. And we're and me and you are big targets. And Kyle and I are big targets, and we just have to play the part right now. Yeah. And it's smart to keep a target that's bigger than you in this house when you're fucking six percent body fat. You guys are fucking six percent body fat, and why wouldn't you want us in the house? Yeah. They said. They said also that like we wanted we wanted jet to use, that they heard that we wanted jet to use the veto, so that Ty went up and we sent Ty home. Me and you. That we came from us. Oh. But again, this this might just be a little shit they would make up. You shut it down, obviously. Yeah. I said, I said, didn't they tell you that Jed Ty would go up? And he's like, yeah. And I was like, that's all I heard. So I knew you weren't going to use it. I asked them if I should talk to Kiefer, and they said yes. But I don't know what I say. Well, Kiefer's in there alone, though. Kiefer is? Yeah. I don't even know what I say to him. Unless Beth is in there, you can just kick Beth out. I don't even know what I'd say to him. Okay, hold on. I'm just gonna get this. I gotta get my story straight here. <laughs> okay, this Tina Terra thing is tricky. So what I said to them is, I was like, with you guys, I, like, I get that you considered Roe being on second league, but you considered it, and then you said no. Right. What Tina and Tara did was consider it, not consider it, consider it, not consider it, right. consider it, not consider it, which just, which pisses me off, because I knew that you guys considered it, just like everyone's talking today, and then shut it down. Mm -hmm. With them, I thought that I could trust them mm -hmm. to just keep Roe, but they flip-flop back and forth, and I can't. I have it moving forward. So like it, I said, it gives me too much anxiety. So we're trying to, we're trying to get them where they're in a place to vote for Kyle to stay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So but like we played nice just okay. in case this scenario happened. Yeah. Where now, if we win HOH, we just haven't been in a position to show who we go after. Mm -hmm. Give us a chance to fucking show. And I don't know if an I don't know if an ultimatum is in place, but like. You can be like, right now my target is Tina and Tara, but if my number one goes, I have no idea who your target is because that changes my mindset so much. I don't know how you word that better. Well, I don't know how you word that better. I gotta be careful about that because in all likelihood I'm going on the block next week if they win, so. Yeah, but I think no matter what you are, probably. I don't know, just like something like that. But yeah, I pretty much just said, I pretty much just talked about myself the whole time. And then they would try to get me to say stuff about Olive. And I'd be like, no, nah, I'm not doing that. I learned from Vic. Yeah. Go hit the ball pit up with Brayden and Austin. Okay. Uh,
Voilà. What's that? What's what's going on? The couch. What's the word? Yeah, I'm just chilling. Where does my fucking ankle hurt? Oh no. I know. Did you ice it today? I should right now, actually, honestly. Yeah. Put it up. Oh, anything? Oh, yeah, well. What is it? Hey! I've been asking for these. I didn't know we got these. That's good enough. No chili powder? No. But that's cool. Oh, oh red kidney beans? Oh. Oh, yeah. You got all the shit. chickpeas? Yeah, you got all the shit. Okay, we're good now. What's our meat? Uh, I got ground beef in the fridge. Oh, they gave it to you. What? What do you mean it was me? It was always in the freezer. I took it out last night. Oh. It should, yeah, right here. didn't know we had chili peppers. Been waiting for those. No, those showed up this morning. The peppers? I, yeah, I, oh, I asked. Listening. I asked for them, too. Right. I'm kind of hungry, though. Yeah, go for it, man. iPod should be charged. What a lazy day. Closes. Hi. <laughs> uh, there's no TP in there. Oh gosh. Thanks for the warning. I think there's I think there's still some in the pan.
I know, I'm gonna tell everyone the roast is in 30 minutes. <laughs> Hey, this is why I don't hang in here. I'm not even in here, I'm fucking sweating so much. Are you guys down for a roast in 30 minutes? Oh, it's in 30? Yeah, okay, or like yeah. If, when you're done or yeah. whatever, I'm just. I haven't thought of any jokes. <laughs> if something comes up, I'll fire it out. You but... could just say, Tara's chess game. <laughs> she... <laughs> she got that technical. <laughs> she did though. She did though. She did. Well, if not, I'll say rock, paper, scissors game. Yeah. That one is fair. <laughs> that one is fair. But because I say it differently. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah, they're down. Tara, Tina, and Ty. <laughs> it's, it's the back corner for me. Hey, what's up? You guys doing okay? I'm dead. <laughs> Bro, quip. Great move. Yep, she's gonna get me. She is gonna get me. Necessarily, still some great people left. Check. If you want him, you have to set. Oh. oh, burn. Down She's to coming you. in fucking hard, man. Down to why. I'm, I'm just anxious for the roast. I'm ready. Are you ready? Oh, yeah. Did you tell Yeah, I told everyone 30 pretty, minutes. I'm pretty ready, too. 30 minutes. Yeah, what? What? You ready? Yeah. <laughs> I'm so excited. You kind of put things quickly. I know. How many, how many do. jokes do you have? I have three jokes. Yeah, I have like four. Five. <laughs> What? You got me or what? I didn't know if I wanted to get you. <laughs> I can get you right now, though. I'll think of another one. No, no, no. don't tell them. I'm so excited. Oh, Canada's going to be pumped. Oh, they're your shit. Gonna Thanks oh. for doing this, by the way. Wow, I, I definitely could have. I come in and you're like. <laughs> you know, I, I had to because I did my hair and there was hair everywhere. Oh, everywhere. Awesome. My hair is falling out like crazy. I put in new extensions today. You could see like the new extensions are like bright pink and then my old extensions are just like. Oh, is that why everyone looks so good today? Yeah, I was, like, I was hair? losing hair, so I added extensions in the back. But you can tell because the colors are different. I well, can't tell. Oh, you barely <laughs> Really? I was like, fuck! Now that you said it, I'm like, oh, a little bit. Like, yeah, hopefully it'll fade in a few days if I just keep straightening it. Or... Faded. Faded. So excited for this roast. Like, seriously, this is my type of fun. Let's keep this big. Mine are more like jokes, though. They're not roasts. It's all right. Anything that'll cut someone down a little bit? Bring me down, baby. I know. Should I spice it up a little bit? Let me see. No, they're good the way they are. Spice it up a little bit. Yours are going to be ruthless. They're not ruthless. They're just like laugh worthy. I'm so pumped. Love a good laugh. Love a good laugh. 
Okay, Kiefer. I love how Jed's ready. I'm like, uh, what do you mean? Yeah, Jed is four. I'm like, what do you mean? Yeah, I was told like five minutes ago. First off, good looking people can't be funny. Huh? I said, first off, good looking people can't be funny. Well, that's why I'm going to kill it. Oh, yeah. Roast myself. Where Tre we got in trouble Trevor for Noah the dryer is the exception. Trevor, oh, that guy, yeah, he's cute. <laughs> oh, bad yeah, Bethel. <laughs> oh, Bethel. Not allowed. Do, 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 do. Run around. Stress bags in this fucking house all the time. No, dead ass. You know what? You're dead right. Dead ass. Dead ass. I look like a brick. You want a little touch up? No, I'm good. <laughs> You ever let the girls put a little makeup on you? No. No? Do your toenail? No. No? My dad is like, don't even touch yeah, me. Yeah, that ain't me. That ain't it? No. Not it's me. not the play? No. I'm so happy people are down to do this. Everyone's down. I know. <laughs> I just hate that I think I'm funny and I, it, like I could see Whoa. I could see these not landing. Like Vic, that's not even funny. Like that's all. Like, you know what? That really actually fucking hurts. <laughs> And Ty's gonna be like, really, Vic? <laughs> Blow someone's game up? Like, no, I will, I'm not blowing I'm nobody's kidding. game up. Fuck that. Ah. I think I got a couple that'll hit hard. Oh, I can't Good. wait. I feel like, Keith, you're gonna have me rolling. I've done stand up a bunch. Have you? Yeah. Oh, damn. You're not kidding. I guess you're gonna be quick on the radio, too. Yeah, true, 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 true. Yo, I do not underestimate you, man. Fuck. Please don't come for me. <laughs> You're not in mine. It would be too ruthless. Oh my gosh. That doesn't make me feel good. <laughs> yeah, there was the roast right there. <laughs> like, that was it. <laughs> oh, Beth, I think you're gonna be funny too. I don't really have much. I don't really have anything. Do you have one? It's stupid. Is it though? Uh, Maybe after a few well, people get going, you'll be like, oh. Yeah, then good... the wheels will start pumping. I'm gonna go see if I can eat something. Smart. Other than bread and butter. Oh man. I got a bunch, holy shit. <laughs> I love it.
I think it's after mean, like, 15 like, moves. This could she, be a long time chasing could, around the board. I know she could. She can mate you still. Yeah. She can. Like realistically. Well, she, yeah, realistically. Just so you know, it's your move. Oh, where'd you move? And then the time. Oh, this one. Yeah. Yeah, you come up for the fucking pieces, aren't you? Mm -hmm. Shithead. Sure is. I know. I can do it. She could just take everybody out. Yeah. <laughs> she will. What are you taking? And here we go. Here we go, Tara. Oh, I didn't have him that long anyway. You can take him. <laughs> Fuck. Uh -huh. Burn. Yes. Yeah, just come on, corner me. Oh my gosh. This got so interesting. This is crazy. Check. Wait, no. I need to take him. Okay, wait, I'm gonna... Okay, wait, hold on. You obviously want to get another war piece. Alright, where's this fucking diamond power veto at? Go ahead. Is it on the screen yet? Smart move. Smart move. Very smart move. So, as soon as I get there, she's got my piece. She's gonna take it out. Yeah. That's a smart move. It's a good move. Wait, where did you just come from? Hmm? Is she already in check? She, uh, no, 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 hold on, go back to where you were. Was she already in check just now? Oh, and we didn't notice? Sorry, no, I was here. I was here. And then I moved there, but yeah, I, I didn't realize. So technically speaking, I wasn't allowed to move there. No, so when did you move there? Before just then, she, just before she I, moved here. I was here, Yeah. right? I she moved here, here and I moved you can't here. Move but there. I can't, that's what I mean, so it has to go you, back to this. You can't move into check. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? She can't make that move. I can't make that move, so we have to go back to my move on the, this one here. Okay, move them in a different direction. Yeah. I'm still gonna make the same one. Yeah, fair. Well, I mean, essentially I'm just moving this asshole around. You're gonna come up and get that one and put me in check. Um, let's go there. I think this is technically a win, but. Yeah, because it's only gonna close in on me anyways. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think I just won my first chess game. Oh, I say. think you did. I wanna show you a move. Go Sarah. for it. Sarah. So. Here's what I wanted you to do, because you had the queen in a situation and you had your rook. But 
you could easily corner the king using both of them. Yeah. You kept right. using one, right? Yeah. So essentially, like, you had a situation where you could have had, say you went here, had the rook here, pulled the queen here, right? Yeah. Where does she have to move now? Here, bam, check. She moves there. Sorry. You had it, you had it kind of like something like right. that yeah. where yeah. you could have cornered them in. Yeah, yeah, So yeah. then it's kind of like a situation where you have to pull... You have to pull them in like that. Pull the pieces yeah. in together. Pull the pieces in it together, in. and then they yeah. have checkmate right now. I yeah. do like because there was a couple of moves. These two, these two together are so yeah. dangerous. Yeah. Guess what? She won her I first game. I just my first chess game. Up top, up top. Let's go. <laughs> you guys ready for the roast? Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Way to go, Tara. Way to oh, go. Are you gonna roast me? Way to go. Uh, do you want to? I don't care. You can roast me. Too. Okay. That was a good game, though. Yeah. Well, it was. Wow. It was a good game. Tara got mad at me. She's like, what did you say? <laughs> I was like, I was like, shut up, Ty. I've never been this close to winning in my life. Yeah, it was good. And of course, you know, only tips for fucking blue line. I didn't even tip. I was just like, oh. Yeah. So yeah. I was like, shut up. But you know what? My, my, biggest, my biggest mistake on that was not taking her queen when I had a chance. Yeah, I saw you guys overlook the queens like yeah, three I times. Had, I had her queen dead on and I overlooked it and didn't take it. Sometimes you just don't see things. No. It happens. That was a good game though, Tara. Good game. That was a great oh game. Oh my goodness. I feel like a million dollars. I gotta put on lip gloss for this roast. Brush my hair real quick. Do I have time to do that? Are you gonna roast people? Uh, I wasn't. I was playing chess. If I think of any rebuttals, I will. But you gonna roast I, people, I, I don't have a roast plan. Oh, yeah, I'm coming for everybody. Are you roasting? You can roast me. I can. Yeah, okay. Go on. This should be Talk fun. about my flailing arms. No. This is time. Yeah, let's do this thing. Oh, that just like with like. Do my pee, get a refill on water, and then it's time to get roasted. I'll be right now, Beth. Yeah, you're the vegetables. Oh, big time! I want some veg. Remember peanut butter and jelly week? You just wanted a salad. Oh yeah, when the pizza came, all I wanted was the salad. Here's the best part. How's your roasting stuff coming? Uh, uh, feel free to roast me if you want. I'm not overly sensitive. I think it'll be funny. If it's in your... You good? I don't think. I wish we had a picture wall of everybody. Not the names of everyone in font size 10. But everyone's gonna be sitting in front of you though. Do you got anything on the spot, Keith? Huh? Maybe. You might think of stuff after you hear people say things. This is true. Come sit downstairs. Come sit downstairs. Yeah. I'm calling it. Oh, damn, V. What? All right. V. Remember when you said row changes 10 times a day? Should I just come for everybody or what? <laughs> is that what you, oh, I was gonna say, is that what you're wearing to the roast? <laughs> I love you so much. I don't even know if we need one, we just pass yeah, it off. I don't think we need one. Really? <laughs> you're on the block and you're talking shit about me. <laughs> <laughs> Are you kidding? Jed's the old loser. Yeah? Mm. Cumbers, eh? 
cucumbers. Cucumber. Mm, 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 mm. Can you see? Probably up in the bathroom where you always leave it. Probably. Is that mine there? Water bottle? Nope. Too bad. Easy. Put on a shirt. <laughs> No, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Yeah, there's some on the fridge if you want. I'll get a fork. I just ate some. I'll just get a fork. <laughs> well, are you done? You're not done with it. I'm assuming. No, I'm not done with it. I thought you just wanted a bite. <laughs> No, he's going to get a fork. <laughs> Dude, I fucking love tofu. I don't care what people say. Wait, what? Tofu. I love tofu, too. I'm a big fan. As long as it's seasoned, then it's fine. No, I agree. I ain't even mad at it in a miso soup, and it's just nah. straight up tofu. Mm -hmm. It's tofu? I've never like, had tofu. That's like fake bacon, I think. <laughs> bacon. Bacon. Can't wait. <gasps> I'm Are you roasting or no? Am I roasting? No. Nah. No? We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see if I pull up. I'm going to go second. I'm going second. Vix claimed her first. I want to go first because one of my jokes has to be first. Okay. <laughs> Which one? About Judd? No, no, no. So uh, you'll see. Big screen going and I'm going to go. No, let me go. No, no, no. Because <laughs> uh, I already called second. You're three. You can go third. We're not making any of my jokes. Two, four, three, eight, nine. I don't think I'll take oh, any man, of these jokes. Oh, man, it's so hot. And I'm wearing this too because my hair's going so gray. Oh. Mm. I think it's that bad, eh? Yeah, it's getting, it's getting bad again. Fading. Yeah, it's very hot in here. It's because the doors are closed. It's all in good fun. We're all going to have a good time. Are you doing this too, Ro, or no? Yeah? How, oh, who, yeah. So who's going? Me, Kiefer, Jed. Brayden Austin. Brayden Austin. Ro. They have some? Yeah, they're up They were up practicing. Oh, okay. You do oh, it? Are they? You do it? I said, come on. Oh, yeah, you know they were. Look, I don't know if I can close the, the fucking show. There. Why not? Yeah, you can. Okay, You're the so. Rose Show, here to close the show. All right, I guess I'll have to. Hope mine are good. If mine are appropriate. <laughs> Tara, I can't. You have to go. You got your hat on and everything. I have to do your vibe. <laughs> <laughs> you say you want to know who you want them to set the tone oh, first? Like, it makes yeah, sense in my is. head. I feel like I hope I've it comes out the same. Head, Matching. Oh, God. Uh, <laughs> oh, there's yours. Oh. <laughs> oh, man. I just. One is very risky, but I'm fucking spicy. V likes it spicy. <laughs> Not risque. Are you guys a, a solo act or a duet? Or you'll see. Yeah, you'll oh, see. You'll see? Okay. <laughs> I'm getting the vibe, but it's a duet. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go with the Are we ready? Everyone here? Oh, fuck. Here we go. Yeah, I'm on third, then. <laughs> yeah, so 